Oh. I'm Honestly. Honestly. Uh, so you want to switch to some study? What, what are you doing right now? Where are you? I'm in you the study menu. Yeah, I logged out a uh, while ago. Okay, I was, I'm, I'm sitting here. I'm standing here with burning fuel like an idiot. Um, Hang on. I'll start up the game. I'll quickly go use the restroom. No worries. Bye. I'm almost in the mood to go like more Valheim sailing today, honestly. Given the opportunity to, given given the given the time to go sailing, I wouldn't mind doing that after Stardew today. Warlock it's, let's, let's say we've been going for five hours. Five and a half. Um Warlock says he's got another five left in him. Ten hour stream for Warlock. So we'll see how I feel ten hours in, whether or not we spend another six sailing around after that. Because I am stubborn enough and stupid enough to actually spend six hours non-stop sailing. The only thing I have to do is not lose the boat. Because that's five five or ten iron sitting in, in, in just the boat itself is worth five or ten iron. And I do not think, we definitely don't have enough to replace it. But I do not think the setback of needing to replace it is going to be a welcome one unless I go out and find all of the iron myself in my own time as well. But I shouldn't kill it. I'm going to stay reasonably far away from the coastline unless I can safely land it. And in that case, if I can safely land it, it's probably because I'm on a black forest and can go exploring. The only risk is, I suppose, death or a troll attacking the portal. While we wait, I always need to remember to do this. Put a stream marker down. I'm not gonna save that too. Where is stream titles? Double space, enter, done. We are changing over to Stardew Valley. What should we name the stream? All right, the world is up. I'll be in in a second. No rush. I'm just letting you know. Spring in Stardew Valley. Okay, I, I'll just quickly go use the restroom and I'll be right back. Hmm. Onions, potatoes, and world origin in Patrick's Archery Valley. Second title of the subtitle should be... We'll just leave it at that, shall we? Short, sweet, and simple today. Stardew. Stardew Valley. Stardeuce. Well, there's a game. Click, click, click.
trying to do one, two, three. One, two, three. Three is a miss. One, two, three. Almost. I can almost get a gallop going. One, two, miss. One, two, miss. Actually pretty tricky. Love the music. I'm a big fan. Actually, I think you mentioned that last time I had SimCity 3000 on, Joe. And I'm getting a lot better at having music at the nice point where it's backgrounds, but still loud enough that it comes forth a little bit during quiet moments. I always get so worried because there's a couple of audio files that play that are so quiet, I still hear them. But the OBS audio meter, the little equalizer thing that shows up there, it lights up. It detects there is sound, but the bar is so low, I am certain it's not coming through on stream. loud enough. Hello, I don't know if your Steam is offline, but I can't find the world. What do you mean? I've... My Steam is offline? Hang on. Uh, no, I'm online. Is mine it's offline? Just... Yes, like... Yeah, yours, it, 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 you're not live on Steam. Ah. I mean, yeah, you're not active on Steam. It's funny how Steam is asking me, like, I'm, I'm on the page and Steam is asking me, like, I've played this game for thousand hours, would you recommend this to people? <laughs> no, I just had nothing else to do for thousand hours, so I decided <laughs> to play this game. <laughs> Yeah, do you see it or do I need to restart the world? Do I, I got it. Yep. It was my end. That was the problem. Sorry. No worries. in a recoverable state. I think that's just dead. You're referring to the Be Right Back music this time. I can switch to Be Right Back in a while. Where is that? Yeah, no, that would have been a while ago. I had Be Right Back up. Worried now, I've left it running without realizing. All right, kill the program. I have no idea where I'm gonna find a wax press. Uh, should I restart my thing? Are you not seeing it? My game crashed. 
probably because I hadn't started up with the friends list enabled or something silly. No worries, I mean, yeah, take your time. Be right back in, SimCity 3000 shouldn't... No, no, they're not the same. Um, the Be Right Back music is from a game called Skatebird. I think both do have a bit of brass in them, so... There may be a couple of songs, but do... I don't know about piano and strings. There may be a couple of instruments between a few of the songs that are similar. This is more like a light, jazzy album. There we go. I see loading in the bottom left. Hey, welcome in. Hey, there we go. There we go. Oh my... Crops. Yeah, because it's like the, the first day of summer. They're from last season. Did we did we not tend the garden last time? No, no, because the first day we went to catch the thing, right? We we played through an end. Oh yeah, we just yeah. ran off to the ocean. Yeah. We can't, we, My rice. So I can give you six. Hang, hang on. Let me just give. Wait. Are we out of season? We are some. We're in summer, right? Yeah. I can give you sixteen melon seeds if you want. Um, yeah, I've got space for him. Where are you? Oh, there you are. Oh, this is annoying. I have to give you one by one. I'm putting it in this black box. I was waiting for that. Thank you. Wait, when did I get a second bin? Having a second bin. You've yeah, been fishing for those. Also, uh, I put the wood and the sap that I accidentally picked up. Oh, yes, thank you for that too. So, what fish are we catching this season, or did we actually get it? We, yeah, we got it. We Okay, so we need to catch some normal fishes for other reasons. For the community center and stuff like the red snapper. Uh, but the legendary fish, we have caught all of them. I have four. How do you mean you have... Mm, you should have five. What one am I miss? What one is the summer fish? The summer fish is the crimson fish. I don't have it's that right one. Next to the angler. It's right next to the angler. Do you not have it? No. Oh, you mean in the collections tab? Come on. Both sides of the angler are missing, so I'll have to find them. I'm sorry, what, what are you missing? The summer fish. Oh, okay. Uh, so you have to go to the furthest corner of the, the beach. That's where you'll find the summer fish. Is that off the... Yeah, off the pier. I remember that. So we're coming back to me. While, while you're at it, I mean... Also, I mean, you know what? I mean, I've, I, I thought about it a little, little bit. I do not want to, like... I've been... I might have been rushing a little bit. We don't have to rush at all. We can, we can do... We don't have to do anything. You can do whatever you want. No, that's fine. I'll go catch the legendary. After that, I wouldn't have a clue what's on the to-do list. Ooh. Uh, while you're at it, like while you're doing that, while you're catching the legendary. Oh, by the way, you're you're. I, I think you got artisan as well, right now, right? No. You leveled up. We're also out of hay. Okay, so I can I can go and do that. I can go and buy hay. All right, let me just quickly plant this red cabbage, which I, we need for the community center, and then I'm gonna, I'm gonna go and buy some hay. Here. 
What a fascinating chest. I must have just dumped some stuff in there and ran last time. Um, God. I've forgotten what we were doing. Genuinely, I'm so out of whack here. Switch to the Be Right Back music, actually, Joe. That's a way to type something. I'll ask when you get back in that manner. Oh my word, do I have the worst hiccups right now? You, I, okay, I asked, I said that I was gonna do something. What was it? Bye, hey, right? Bye, hey. Um, I can make grass starter, but I don't know when it grows. Well, I mean, it's fine. I'll go get the hay. I have some money. I can go get the hay. We have 300 just in a chest, but we just don't have any in the silo, so we have to manually feed. Oh, okay. No, no, no. You can put it in the silo. Just take the hay, equip it, and right-click on the silo. It goes in the silo. You can do it- Oh, that's- okay. That's why you wanted the chest down there. Yeah. That makes way more sense. You can also do it at the inside the coop, like if you if you point at the if you point at the thing, if you point at the what's it called, the hay feeder inside the coop. You can put it from there as well. You can put hay back in. Yeah, you can put the hay back in, the one you're taking here out of. And you can also go and buy some seeds if you want. Okay, so we got a the silos full. Okay, yeah, because it, it holds 240, so you cannot put 300 in. Easy. I'll leave that there. We'll leave the silo full, because we want hay in the silo. That's the catch, right? Taking it out of the silo to put in chest is merely just a backup. But the backup, the reason you have the backup is when the silo runs out. You want it in the silo almost at all times. So, the music actually a little bit loud, isn't it? means we have 10 hay extra if we ever run out. So if we run out, we're in trouble. I suppose that's maybe one of the reasons why you'd want a reserve is so that when you run out, you can put more in. But it, it's like counterproductive because you're taking hay out of the system only to feed it back into the system later. I feel like the only reason you would take hay out of the system is because you can put more back in immediately. Because when you cut grass, when you cut grass with a scythe, it immediately goes back in. To the silo, that is. So you would take some hay out so that you can put some back in. Otherwise, I feel like there's no reason to take any out. Not allowed. So the music's so quiet now that it can't be heard. Well, there's a curse. Halfway point it is.
this point, I swear, it's actually almost like an associative thing where I play Stardew and get tired. I was so ready to go sailing in Valheim. Open Stardew immediately just... Mm. It's not like I don't want to play it. I love the game. It's just this... It is... I have to assume it's associative at this point. I have a synapse in my brain that says when I play Stardew it's sleep time. What a terrible thing to have on any form of entertainment. With all the stories you hear about, I should say with all the stories, with some of the stories you hear about people going to the theatres and falling asleep too, I wonder if that's applicable to, to other mediums for other people. Like, to go to a theatre to sleep. The concept is fascinating because it boggles the mind you would go to one of the noisiest places on the planet to try and catch some sleep, let alone spend $40 for the privilege in some cases. To be fair, we want to be able to traverse between them, so it's probably best not to landlock them so you can't pass. Um, um, does that mean we end up doing that though? I feel like the pattern of three has to be the most applicable. That's not good. Oh. being betrayed. We'll chop this one down as well. God, the days go so much faster in Star Trek than they do in Valheim. Goes so much faster in Stardew. In multiplayer, especially. Yep, they do. Um, God, we have so much. Let's go tap some of these trees. Should have gone off on my own break between games. I could do with a bit of a snack. I have three more chicken tenders in the fridge, as well as an uncooked steak with mushroom gravy. Mushroom and pepper gravy. It is. Okay. I'm calling it mushroom gravy definitively because it has physical mushrooms in it. I use two, um, I, I buy instant mug soup, I put the instant mug soup, two of them, into a saucepan and then added a bit of beef gravy powder. Uh, the problem is a bit was a complete 
lack of measurement entirely. I tipped the thing over until the beef powder gravy started crumbling out. Um, except as what usually happens with those substances in that format is that you don't sprinkle gravy powder into the saucepan, you dump a whole heap of it in. So, lesson not learned, I'm going to do it again, but I made beef gravy powder and put mushrooms physically in it. <laughs> it's still very nice. I watered it down because it was so thick from the gravy powder too. I don't mind a thick gravy. Um, I didn't make a whole lot of it either. Nor did I measure how much powder I put in. I would like to try next time. I think what I'm going to do... Sorry. sorry. Oh, that's perfectly fine. I'm not in I'm not in any rush, don't worry. Next time I'm gonna put in maybe a tablespoon, maybe two of beef gravy powder. And I'm gonna see if I can thicken it with purely with the mug instant soup. i I buy them in packs. It's two dollars for four four mugs. So it's fifty cents a mug effectively. Um I'm gonna buy three of them and I'm gonna pray, cross my fingers, I can make mushroom soup out of four mugs worth of soup. Mushroom gravy. What I want to do is use the two tablespoons max of beef gravy powder to make the base and then add the mushroom soup on top to try and give it the texture and the flavour. And then of course, on top of that, physically adding the mushrooms again like I did this time. But we'll see how it goes. I've already been giving some people a hand around town. Everyone seems really thankful. I'm awarding you this month's Beth Neighbor Award with a small cash prize. Ooh. Apparently, there's a good neighbor award. Did you get it? Yeah. Nice. Jeez. Is that actually given out every month? I mean, you get it once. Oh. <laughs> I did not get it. I think I got. I don't know. I didn't get it. We should be able to get it once each, because it's obviously tied to mission progress, I guess. It seems like it'd be a thing hand so. in like yeah. 20 missions. Um, do we need anything done today? Otherwise I'm gonna go try and catch the legendary fish. Yeah, if you, if you yeah, like we need to catch the red snapper and uh, you find that at the beach as well. So if you're going to catch the legendary that's actually killing two birds, I mean no, what should I say? Not birds, but something else. <laughs> Killing two Hugans with one stone. Is that allowed? I'm sorry? Killing two Hugans with one stone? Two I kind of with one, but I like that's that's a bird as well, right? I've punched Hugin more than in my fair share of occasions. Yeah, I've, I've punched Hugin a lot. Yeah, I think I think of yeah. We have all punched Hugin. But I have to milk the cows as well, damn it. I, I need to get a like I have to save twenty five thousand and then I'll go get this thing, the auto better. Not the auto better, the auto grabber. At least for the cows. It's annoying to you know, to keep doing that. Mm. It'd be nice to have a steady supply. Can you get anything like that for the chickens? Yeah, we can get for both of them, but they cost twenty-five thousand each. I mean, I yeah, that, we will have to get them, but like we have to save the money and then get them. Bad luck, no fiddlehead farm over here. That's one thing we needed for the community center. It's not here. It's the only place where you can find it. It sucks, actually. Like, this is the only place where you can find it. There are vegetables and fruits in this game that just give you negative energy. I think it's the flower and some fish and uh, the void mayonnaise and the void egg. 
How about the void egg? I think it's still good. The void mayonnaise is minus something. And some fish just do you dirty. Like uh, uh, the, the red mushroom. I was in the mines. I, I was out of food. I found red mushroom. I was like, yeah, I, I can eat this. I ate it and I instantly painted. It was like minus 60 energy or something. in my house I keep forgetting about. Oh yeah, you planted a strawberry plant, didn't you? It's not dead. Good news. I mean, it won't die. It, it, like, it, if you don't water it, then it'll not... It'll stop producing, but it won't die. This is complete food. This is raw ingredients. How do I have those? In the egg. Oh, ocean fishing bundles actually done up for the red snapper. Yep. Uh, we need the red snapper and also we need a few other things which I'm not being able to find. Purple mushroom. Which we only find in the... It's like RNG right now. I've never actually found the fiddlehead fern. I don't know where you get them. Can you grow them? get them in the mystery forest. No, in the mystery forest. Oh, we can't catch the red snapper today. It has to be a rainy day. Otherwise, we can't catch the red snapper. But you can go for the... You go for the thing. You go for the legend. That explains so much. There is also like you don't need rain for the legendary you can get it today you just have to like if, if you want you can get, grab like on my in my refrigerator there is like a dish of the sea you can grab that i have a trout soup left over that's yeah that's good as well like that's plus one yeah that, that's good as well Salmon berries in. That's probably annoying, isn't it? Triple profits, though. Friends mute. Alright, and the final thing. need to go check the back cave to make sure that there's no veggies we need. Do we not have a purple mushroom? We do not. I was just thinking that. I need to go down to the caves and find this mushroom floor. I think I saw one yesterday but I just left it there because... And damn. We could have completed that. At least it's fine. By the way, everything is like only one or two things away. And like most of the things, like I'm growing the red cabbage already. It'll be done in a few days. Um, the apple tree is happening. It's, it's happening. We might get lucky with uh, the fruit bat cave as well. We just need three apples. Oh, not one, not two, three. I've got two. We just need one. The first apple of the season is the one we need. in the complete wrong direction too. <laughs> For the legendary fish, I should be heading south. 
But it's already 6 p.m. Hopefully it rains tomorrow and I can two birds, one stone. I think, honestly, unless we get in a pinch for time, I'm gonna two birds, one stone the red snapper and the legendary fish. I'm going, I'm short of wasting like one extra day just to get a bit more income, because fishing is pretty lucrative, especially ocean fishing, uh, super lucrative. Cool? No, uh, it was the topmost chest to the left of your house. Yeah, but it's like right now, that's a food box now. So I'm, I'm putting the seeds in that box as well for the time being. are the worst. Mushroom hunt, so I'm just gonna dive immediately down if I don't find it. I do have... I did write down Mushroom Floor stats, but I think it's different per world. Let me see if I can find it. Uh, Starbound Coordinates is not the same game. That's it in Google Drive. Personal. Time to head home. Pop up dungeon codes. Stone half far bound again. Don't have it. Do I really. Is it in junk? No way I put it in the junk folder, right? No. Search. Search! Oh my lord. Search. Mushroom. Just search for mush. There we go. Wouldn't that have been hilarious if the whole I would whole time I was trying to search for the file, I was standing on the mushroom floor, I think might have been an actual kick myself moment. All we need is one purple mushroom. If I had tabbed back in to find it at midnight and also a purple mushroom in front of me, I think that would have been... Hmm. A little disappointing. Uh, nope. 
that one. I don't know, I don't have Arson, but... Oh. Not even searching. What's wrong with Windows Explorer? What's wrong with the music looping twice to the same song? Oh, it's raining. Nice. And to get the red snapper. Yep. through my computer for a file called mush so that I can try and see if I can figure out where the mushroom floor is. I know I did the math on a different save file but that's the one thing I'm not sure about is whether or not this save file will translate. There is a decent chance that it might. It could be any amount of random algorithm put into the game that causes it not to. I should put the crab net here. I also shouldn't pick these up. Too late now. We need a rainbow shell for something, don't we? Uh, we, yes, we need, we need, you have to go to the rail, railway platform up north and yeah, put it in the container box. I did that yesterday, I'll be in, yeah. Ooh. I'm yawning! This game is a curse. Oh, that cork is so nice. Red mullet. A purple red mullet. We have enough green algae to last us forever too. I'm borrowing your workbench. <laughs> no worries. Hey, too. I had the legendary on the line. Oh. I've got the wrong lure for it. I got close because I have the cork instead of the trapper. Oh, you, you'll you'll get it this time, don't worry. I'm catching red mullet instead of red snapper, though. Yeah, I mean, uh, it's it's kind of rare, I think. I'm not really sure, but I think it's kind of rare. It shouldn't be though. 
If I haven't seen one by the time I catch the legendary, then I might go up to the river and see if it's a river rain fish. Uh, it's not. It's actually I mean I looked it up. Okay. It's supposed to be. I mean I look everything up at this point. Rapalua now. He's got no chance. Here we go. No. Okay. I got so ready to fight for the angler, for the uh, legendary fish, and it just never shows up. A flounder. A sneeze. No? Okay. <laughs> I get so ready! I hear the doon do and I'm just... I want to fight. I want to fight the fish. I've got... I don't want to waste the trapper lure now. I should have brought two down. I made three. we go. What? This fish is acting different though. Maybe it's a red snapper. I curse myself when I say anything, don't I? Sure, snapper is an ocean fish. I don't know if red snapper isn't. Red mullet is in here. I just don't know why I'm not finding it. So annoying. I better get a redo at that. Crimson fish. There we go. Hey, GG. Nice. I had one where it just flew from top to bottom immediately. And then the one where I caught it, it just sat still. It didn't fight. Nice. I mean, it knew that it did not have a chance. So it's like, yeah, you know what? It just accepted its fate, kind of. I have not seen a single red snapper here, though. Hedge my bats. I'm gonna spend the rest of the day in a river. Here, fishy, fishy, fish. We still have one to find. So I'm gonna go up and spend the rest of the day in the river here. We have to catch it. Alright. 
If I spend a whole day in the rain, in the ocean, and don't catch a red snapper, I'm gonna see if I can do anything elsewhere, right? That makes sense. It's not silly. I mean, results-based analysis says it's only silly if it is an ocean fish and I've just been really unlucky. The shed. It would make sense, right? Unless we got the season wrong. I just mean, surely I would have seen one by now. Unless it's deep open, okay. Let's head out onto the edge of the pier because it might be deep open, uh, deep ocean fishing. really fancy the idea of splitting my inventory two ways so we're gonna we're gonna fish ocean fish today and not split it hey it's a different one this could be a cucumber knew it called it i know my fishing Just so I can start from a known point, it's been uh, this this playlist currently for the entire duration of Stargy Valley has been the SimCity 3000 playlist. <clears throat> if you ever hear lyrics about birds, that's usually what I have on the AFK music. Although I could be I could be wrong. There's actually double check before I get too ahead of myself I may have changed it and forgot and I suppose one of the benefits of being a hey is that I'm not privy to whatever everyone else is doing. Let's have a quick look. Studio mood. AFK be right back. Mm, is on skateboard. Okay. AFK music is what I thought it was. I like both albums. I wholeheartedly recommend everyone goes. I mean, I don't know if you can buy the SimCity 3000 Unlimited album. If you could, I probably wouldn't be playing it right now. Uh, the licensing, I believe, is owned by EA, though, and the game is purchasable on Origin. And good old games. Good old games I would recommend over Origin. It's midnight, I gotta head back. Would have been awkward if I threw away my fishing rod. I would have been very sad if I threw away my fishing rod and it landed in the ocean. So the music you've been listening to is from the game SimCity 3000 Unlimited. The game is available on goodoldgames.com.
I am now officially the garbage lady. No one can find me on that. into the into the cell box and got very close to clicking the the uh, legendary in there. Yeah. I've been there. I've sold it actually. <laughs> Absolutely. What's what are they worth? Like five grand each or something? Yeah, something like that. The legend. It's the I think it's a most profitable fish, but you can only catch it once. So it's like you just get five k once. That's yeah. I don't know if that's worth it. Trash sells for zero gold. Yep, it does. <laughs> However, okay, so I've given the sales pitch for SimCity 3000 Unlimited, buy it on good old games. That's, well, it's SimCity. But if you just want the music, I mean, it's probably cheap enough to justify getting it for the music alone. <laughs> what I have for my AFK screen is from a game called Skatebird. I don't remember if I have a command set up for Skatebird, but I should get one. That game is currently available on Steam, was released last year, and is the best game you'll ever play. I don't mean, <clears throat> I might be a little biased. Being a bird, and thinking birds on skateboards might be pretty cool, I may be biased, so take it with a grain of salt. But it is a pretty cool skate game. If you like, like, I mean, if you have pastime playing a couple of skate games in your childhood, you could spend the worst $20 to get 20 hours playing this occasionally. And the soundtrack is sold separately on Steam, currently available on the storefront. But I don't know the app ID, so I can't randomly type it in chat, unfortunately, but... Hmm. The chests have moved. What's in green? Ooh. What's in black? More of the same stuff down here? Or is this one now empty? So the snapper is only during rain, so that can't be caught today, can it? I'm sorry, could you repeat that? The music was too loud. I had to turn it down. The snapper is the one that's only during rain? Yes. Oh, truffle. Did you find it at the traveling cart? No. I've not been down south yet. We have enough piggy! We do, and I think it's... Is it all grown up right now? No. No. Oh. That's fine, it will be. Hmm. 
I do not know where truffle oil is made, so that's just gonna go in the green chest. Oh, uh, the truffle oil machine is inside the barn. All the cheese maker and everything else is inside the barn, yeah. I'm gonna make a box actually for that. That's a good, good, that's a good point. Where's the green box? Is this, is this the one? You just ran past it. It's the one the from your house. Oh my lord, I have the sniffles today. What am I doing? Green is green for green for greenery. Oh, pat the duck, pat the rabbit. Lots of eggs. Hang on a minute. Why is Godzilla inside? eggs this morning what happened we have so many iridium eggs yeah I mean we are getting in a good relation with the birds So the milk and truffle and uh, all the dairy thing, that box, uh, the white box is right now inside the barn and uh, all the machines regarding that is inside the barn as well. So yeah, you can just like put like put the access inside the box and then put everything inside the machine. No worries. I'll be sure to put stuff in there if I move it that way. Normally head over north I'm sorry, in the morning. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Like, what did you say? I just I put stuff in there if I head over that way. Oh yeah, yeah. and you can like I I can just make another box and put it there. You don't have to put it there every time. What's I can stop through the inventory. Do the goats produce a wool? Mm, the rabbits produce the wool. It's wool over here. I need a cup of tea. Oh! What was I gonna say? I was gonna say yeah, something when you got uh, back, so Joe. The wool machine is actually next to the green chest, but I'm gonna move the wool machine to the green chest uh, to inside the barn as well. So that all... Or maybe you know what? The wool machine should be moved next to your thing. Your egg mayonnaise machine thing. Because that's where we get the wool from. Oh wait, do we yeah. have a sheep? We don't, right? No... We yeah, have goat. pigs, cows, goats, and... Rats. So, that's why I'm wondering, does the goat produce wool? Because that's the only thing I can think of over there that would even drop it. No, that's what I was thinking. Nope, I'm going to move all the wool back to your thing. As soon as I check on the cart lady. Oh, she, of course, she does not have what we need. chest oh, and the orange chest oh we haven't checked the, the thing for a while have we the bat cave i was in there a little while ago but there were no apples it might have a couple more since nope oh the horse placement yeah i mean uh, i can move it back i okay come here i'll show you something i mean it i think it looks like it fits the house if i put it like this I was, that's what i was trying to figure out 
It does actually. The roof looks so nice like that. That's what I was trying to but like and also I was thinking like I have not seen you use a horse once. Do you do you not like a horse? I keep forgetting we have it. It's because the cart system's instantaneous. You can't go everywhere. Like you can't take the cart to the beach, I guess. I mean, I mean, I guess you can always take it to the town and from there you can go to the beach. This is also the first time I've even had a horse to, um, at all in the game. What I'm Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to get another horse and I'm, I'm going to put it down uh, for you next to your house. That way we can both have two horses. Yeah. Uh, have you decided who you want to marry? No, apparently. Um, I was told the wizard isn't dateable. Mm, I mean, not without a mod. With a mod, you can date anyone. Even Lewis. People, people have done that. <laughs> I swung at a slime. And there was a rock in front of me as well. The rock died as well. And I realized I just one-shot a crab. Oh, okay. I was like, that was so, that was so hilarious, though. Yeah, to see a rock explode into goo. Confused for a second yeah, there. GGs. Hell yeah, that's, that's quite a feat. I'm trying for this purple mushroom today. I haven't. Go for it. Also, is it your lucky day? I never check. Right, I looked it up. You're right. I looked it up. Like if you, if you, if you like, uh, if you find the mushroom floor, it stays the same for the day. Yeah, it's a set thing based on month, day, and year. So you can track it down, and it moves a specific amount too. So you can know where it is going to be tomorrow. Right, and also with the other thing, what's it called? Uh, the infested floors. Like you know, sometimes you hit floors, and it says this area is infested. So that one is, yeah. That one is fixed as well. That's what I'm trying to say. I actually didn't know that. Uh, should I sell the mayonnaise or do you need the money? If you need the money, you can sell the you can. No, I've got 30,000 at the moment. You sell it. Okay. mission to collect a hundred slime. What? I don't have that. I thought it's one of the early ones you get from the Adventurers Guild. I think I've already done that, I guess. That was the, like, kill ten slimes, I think. That's... Uh, that's the initiation. I thought they had a tally for a hundred. Maybe that's just on that billboard in the shop. Oh yeah, that, that was, yeah, that, that was, I think that was uh, the monster eradication goal. I picked the Robins project, but yeah, we're not going to make it. It's like 80 pieces of hardwood in like three days. Yeah, not happening. Must be my lucky day. There's so much stuff down here. And I'm gonna have to head back. Sadly, no luck. How is my file search going? Bye. 
Ice berries do give a lot, but we'll sell the star stuff and we'll make the goods out of the um out of the regular brain. It's not time to turn off. Where is this one? Sometime. We'll do it in the morning. I didn't sell anything, so I can't pause, but I don't know if you want a coffee break or a tea break or something. Oh, I did sell something. Yeah, we can we can take a short break. Yeah. I you did not take a break, did you? Yeah. I didn't before, so Go I wouldn't mind getting a cup of tea. Uh how long? I mean I mean <laughs> that sounded like like you're in jail or something, but I, I just like oh. how long are we only time to boil the kettle, I suppose. No, I mean, five, like, minutes? If five minutes, ten minutes, go for what I'm just like, because according to that, I'll plan like what I'm going to do during this break. Yeah, five minutes. If if you go, five it minutes. Takes a couple to boil the kettle. Yeah, because if you're going for ten, then I'll probably do the dishes as well. I think, yeah, but no, five minutes is fine. Okay, I'll be back. No worries. I'll see you then. Five minute break. I'm also going to put on some chicken tenders in the air fryer, but they'll cook. They'll, I, I turned the temp down and the timer up, so they'll cook at 160 for 20 minutes instead of 180 for 10. The idea, well, actually, could I do 10? Let's do 10, because I have a feeling that the days in this game go past in about 10, 15 minute intervals. So I'm going to set that going, get myself a cup of tea, and I'll be back in about five minutes. Don't go anywhere.
Adio. Hello. Chicken on. And I'm back. I think next time I take a break, I'm gonna have to do some stretches because I really am in need of... My core is on fire. I've spent the last three days streaming for all of the day for all three. I've been getting up streaming and that's been it. So what happened on the Friday? The Thursday, hang on, what did I do on the Thursday? It was No Man's Sky, was it? No Man's Sky into Shoe and Maidens, um, which ended early. But then, I'm actually trying to think now. Has it been three days in a row, or did I just sleep for one of them without realizing? I may have just fallen asleep for one of the days without realizing. <laughs> Asking if anyone else here has a Logitech G920 is completely left the field and no one's going to answer that. Does anyone here know leather care? Or more specifically, how would one tell the difference between pleather and leather? Because this could very well be pleather and I know those two materials require different care. So far I've been cleaning it quite physically, as in um, <laughs> with a a delicate nail file and I don't file the leather don't get scared I use the blunt tip it's a rounded tip on the nail file and I scrape it lightly along the grooves to clean it up and then go over it with like a paper towel or a cloth of some kind um, just because I'm very averse to using liquid on this stuff and I have no idea how to tell the difference between pleather and leather I tried going to a car guy in town and asking how do you clean leather steering wheels and he said well you could just use a cloth um well I should rephrase I should rephrase my question specifically was how do I know if my car has pleather or leather and he gave me generic answer like oh just clean it with water and a cloth he didn't actually tell me how to tell the difference because if I know what this material is made out of that's Perhaps Logitech would have the info somewhere in their site. You can sure bet if it's real leather, they definitely have it on their site somewhere because that would be an advertising angle. But if it's not real leather, the lack of saying would leave it up to ambiguity whether or not I want to clean it like leather or not. I mean, it's not like, look, if this thing, if the leather gets worn out or 
mistreated somehow. That's not the end of the world. This thing cost me... 200? Like, just 199 I got this for. With a hate shifter and the clutch pedal and every all the other goodies, bells and whistles, right? So... The fact that the parts are modular means that I can replace the wheel alone. I don't have any need to replace... Oops. Don't have any need to replace the whole unit. I can keep the hate shifter, I can keep the pedals, all I need is another wheel. <clears throat> Not long before I got the message sent. Hey! By the way. No, it's all good. I've just been chatting and actually, well, maybe I could pose the question to you. Do you know how to tell the difference between pleather and leather? Because I've been rambling about not knowing the difference to anyone who's really interested in listening. Have you ever heard of pleather? Plastic leather? Well, I was gonna say, I was gonna say, like, you know, it's pleather is leather with a P, but then now that you've explained plastic leather is the joke's right. But plastic leather. I mean, I've heard of similar things. I've like <clears throat> that. I think Levi's has that has that one jeans. It's not leather, but then it's jeans made out of plastic. So I'm guessing it's something similar. Because I have no idea how to tell the difference. But you get some car manufacturers that will sell. It'll say leather, but it's actually it's it might have a proper name. Yeah, but I I wouldn't know. I'm in need of finding some maintenance kit for this wheel. I just don't know if I need to look for leather maintenance kit or if it's pleather, whether or not I can just get cleaning products. Fisherman wants it. Good puffer fish. Do they actually need a good puffer fish, or can I give them any? making money, I actually don't know what the rabbits do. I have to be perfectly honest, I am clueless on how they- hang on. <laughs> I forgot to do- <laughs> I forgot to mute my music. <laughs> and I forgot to turn my AFK screen off when I got back. Everything, ev like the whole lot. I, I forgot to do everything. The whole thing is scuffed. Trust me. Alright, now I need to figure out... The only thing we need for like getting another horse thing is like the... I mean I have the money, I just don't have the hardwood. How much do you need? I mean there's 57 in that box next to the workbench. Uh, I think we need 100 hardwood for the horse machine. Alright, I'll split mine over here then. Okay, where are you? Back at the farm. I'm gonna go fishing once I'm done clearing out my inventory. I 
I'm sorry, Jer. You could have known what the AFK music was like, except I'm a dolt. Radish. Oh, I can. There you go. This new game about the witch and the wood it looks really interesting. Yeah, it does look really nice. I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna get it, but it, it's it's definitely one of those games I'm gonna be watching people play through. It feels kind of open worldish, but then it's not entirely open world. There are, like you're, you're, there, there are game restraints. I was watching someone earlier. It just has a map. A, a, a vast map to explore or something? Mm -hmm. Something like that. I mean, and also, it, I don't know, I, I, it, it looks a lot like a mobile game. Like that's something. Is I mean, it? I'm not pissing on it. But it looks adorable, that game. I found 43 copper pity little tiny chunks down in the mines. I'm sorry? I found 43 copper chunks down in the mines the other day. Oh, that's the GG's. We can we can make a lot of quality for uh, like... What is it called? The thing. Sprinklers, uh, quality sprinklers. Yeah. Uh, it's already midday. I gotta go. Okay. Red snapper! It will be mine. I'm sorry? I'm gonna go get the red. Why do I even have half energy? Interesting, the sweet. I mean, sweet pea is a flower, isn't it? It's not actually a pea. This yeah, it's, it's, it's a flower. I might. No. <laughs> I gotta remember to hit that button when I don't want to talk on both streams. Okay, we can do this. myself to do it. I was gonna say, let's switch over to Skatebird soundtrack. I found it! GG's. I was I missed the fish looking at that. <laughs> Sorry. Oh that's fine. I mean that's like I was it was probably something stupid. Like Immediately, the red snapper goes in here. It's iridium, but that's fine. Oh my lord! Apparently, I use this as a dumping chest. <laughs> I found about seven eggs. You found what? I found seven eggs in that chest. I think I used it to dump all my stuff in. Damn. Oh, we had the thing for Gus. Did we get 24 eggs to Gus? Yes, we finished that one. Did we get the cutscene where he was making the omelette? No, there's a cutscene for that. Uh, there, yeah, there is a cutscene for that. So now we just wait for the thing, uh, the apples, I guess. That's the only thing remaining. Yeah. We'll check the back cave the... tomorrow. 
Yeah, because I'm already growing the thing and like worst case scenario we already have like we already have a, like an apple tree growing so by next month it, it will be done I actually think we planted it just in time for it to give fruit on the first day of fall, right? I hope so. Yeah, I, I really hope so. Five p.m. Well, he always leaves his place at five p.m. Third. You said people in the town will knock over anything in their path, right? What happens if they walk into the horse? Oh, they, they just like, if they walk into you or your horse, they will get mad. You'll see an exclamation sign above their head and then they just glitch to you and walk, keep walking at a faster speed. Like they just, re that's, you know, speedrunners use that to uh, make Pam reach the bus faster like she reaches the bus stop at 5 right uh, I mean at 10 right so if you use the technique if you just wait in front of her house wait for her to leave and then just block her path she gets mad and she starts walking faster and she reaches like at 940 so you get 20 minutes more such a tiny time save but I love it yeah so if you watch the study speedruns like it's filled with a zillion of this tiny time saves. Like sometimes, I mean, I watch all these things. Sometimes I don't. I, I don't even understand. Like they did something. I was like, why did they do that? What sense does it make? And then I look up, look it up, or you know, I just find their channel on Twitch and I just go and ask them. Like I was watching this video. Why did you do that? And most of the times they're nice enough. They explain. Like you know, this is why I do that. This is why I did this. I never knew that was actually a um that's actually a weapon there. PM and put the snapper in the community center. Yeah. I'll just, you know what? I'm gonna give you all the fish. You can go ahead and sell them. Because I'm selling all the artisan products. Oh wait, no, you have money. Still on 30,000 at the moment. Yeah, I love money. You know what? Yes. Tonight, I gotta go get my chicken. Tomorrow night, we're gonna switch over to the star, uh, the skatebird, starbird. The skatebird soundtrack will be the background music for the rest of the stream today. Although that's going to be very weird transitioning from Skatebird soundtrack into end of stream Skatebird soundtrack. It's fine, we'll switch the end of stream song over. I like my modular setups. I like my modular setups. Back. back. Having playlists ready to go that I can plug and play into a scene is probably the best thing I ever learned how to do or realized could happen in OBS. Oh. Don't mind if I do. To be fair, I've never actually gone back and spoke with Gus since we put the egg mission through, so... I can smell those chicken tenders though. I'm definitely getting those tonight. 
Shi. That one's not putting through an iridium. <laughs> we have one spot free. Wow, they're all yelling at me. Fade to white. When we're done here, we'll return to the other world. Oh, there's a lovely carpet here. Can we use the fish tank in the community center? No, unfortunately. Oh. Cabbage. I'm gonna see if I can find the poppy. Over at um, Pink Shop. I've planted a poppy seed, and the Pink Shop is closed. I mean, yeah, I've, I've planted the poppy seed. It's growing. But can we buy wheat and hay from Mani? Can't we? We can. I mean, we can. Yeah, wheat we can't buy. We have to grow that. I think I'm growing wheat as well, or maybe we have wheat somewhere. The other thing I am. Yeah. We. I think we have wheat somewhere in a box. Pretty sure. If not, we can just. We're also out of. I mean, no. This is this is wheat season. We can just. They take four days to four days to grow. I know we have. How many, how we many have four wheat? wheat. We need ten wheat. We have one. One. It's a silver star wheat. And I'm just gonna sleep. I'll sell everything in the morning. Yeah, I don't think wheat sells for much, even if it's cold wheat, so we can actually give that away. We need 10, did you say? Mm -hmm. okay, so I don't know if you need 10, like 9 regular wheat and 1 silver still works, right? Yeah, you can like, yeah, different qualities you can stack. You can mix and match all the different things that you want. Right! It's time for me to very quickly run away. GG's. Nice. Look at them. They're, Chicken they're, tender they're, they're time. They're doing a dance. Like a, you know, like a... Like, I don't know, like some... Like a rock concert kind of a dance. Okay. completely forgot I sold anything that morning. Did the save screen have a... I assume the save screen gets stuck for both of us like that, doesn't it? <laughs> I thought I, I thought I was I thought I was like I was already like I thought I was waiting for you but I guess you were waiting for me as well so I guess the game just stuck there for a while. It does take a while sometimes I swear. I don't know if it is like Oh, she's giving you the cloth machine. Oh. I don't have enough space for it. Oh, I can now access Emily's sewing machine. Oh. 
Okay. I'll be back. No worries. No, I mean in game. I'm not, I'm not <laughs> doing AFK. Is there any reason to keep artifacts? Because I have just been selling them. I mean, if you if if you you know how to check if they they have already been submitted, right? Yeah. So yeah, if, if they've been submitted, just sell them. We don't need them. And they don't sell for... I mean, some of them sell for a good, good amount of gold. Like the, the fan it sells for a good, good, good amount of gold. But everything else is pretty much junk. know if you can get large dock eggs to be fair. We have... that needs to go in here. That needs to go inside and so does that. Many. Oh. What? Let's go over here. A fried egg is one egg any. We need rice. I suppose I'm gonna go spend a thousand dollars on rice. This seems like the day for it. Also, you wanted, I think you wanted me to go with you to Marnie so that you can go get the thing. I mean, I'll open the door, you'll go, go get the shots. Oh, yeah, I wanted to see if we could do that. Yeah, because I, I, I don't think I'm giving my version because I'm wearing it right now. Shall we go have a look and see if Manny lets me in if you open the door? Sorry. Mm. Adjusting my headphones because they annoy me sometimes. Of 
Go lock immediately. Oh my god. Me time to eat some of these spring rolls there. Jane woke up to me. Jane walked up to me and said, I'm busy, can't you tell? That is that is a power move right there. I actually thought he was gonna open the door and walk in. I don't know why he's just standing there. He's very clearly not busy. Because he has nothing to do. <laughs> Okay, so the text message that says you're not good enough friends is just there whether the door is open or not. Marnie opened the door and it still says I'm not good enough friends to go in Marnie's room. Okay, the door is open. I just get blocked saying I need to be better friends. Damn. That's so mean. I can't find Haley. Wait, is she doing the photography thing today? I don't think she is. Final egg. Apologies. Mm. Well, that cutscene took a while. 
So I guess we're going back home. We're not going in the caves. And tonight is the night for Sir Jervet Escape Bird. myself muted for a bit because spring rolls are very crunchy. Speaking of crunchy... I'm gonna start doing. Start using tab more and I'm gonna tab over here to get access to a second row of tools. I could almost have all three, right? Wombat. Gardening. these geodes open. All of the artisan goods you want to sell are in the pink chest, by the way. Okay.
Hi, Tim. <laughs> I've been... I saw the messages pop up right as I took a bite of chicken. So the delay is going to be even extra long. Since there seems to be about 15 seconds between the, um... Captain Stream. Okay. Welcome in town. How was Deep Rock Toe? I know I saw you doing um that complicated looking Valheim build when I um when I left. What is this? Floor am I on? Ah! Okay, muscle memory. Maybe sword comes back here. You dare. Just block. There. I'm actually gonna die before these things do. That was my unlucky day, but that was abysmal. To do? Did a four boss run in a go? How much money? <laughs> a four boss run in Valheim. Which ones did you fight? Or four dreadnoughts in because that boss fights they exist in Deep Rock as well. Could be four boss run in Valheim or four dreadnoughts in a row. We're relatively rich. 33,000 is a fair amount of money. But it can disappear super quickly, unfortunately. No Deep Rock today. I swear it said you were playing Deep Rock earlier. Although, my. S Actually, that could have been a bug. Steam might have been scuffed. Um, turns out I didn't realize until later today, but I didn't have Steam friends enabled. I was signed out. I was signed into Steam, just not the friends list. Of course, that doesn't matter with Valheim because you connect to a server through the Steam server list, not through the friends list. It wasn't until I tried joining Warlock here in Stardew that I realised I wasn't even signed in. So, long story short, I've noticed that that causes weird bugs to happen. In the Steam overlay, it'll still show you as online, but it will show people from like... Basically, it remembers what people were doing when you sign out and shows them as online doing that. 
So I guess I signed out yesterday while we were all playing Deep Rock and never signed back in. Depending how long we stream for here today, I want to go back and do some Valheim sailing. But we do have quite an extensive list of to-dos in Valheim. The first to-do is sailing Silver back to the main base and starting the smelting process. The second process is then taking the boat back to Bone Mass and sailing north because we still haven't found Haldor. And I I guess I would say I'm done in, in Valheim today if we find Haldor. But given we've spent what could be close to actually 40 hours, I mean way more than that if you count each person's playtime individually, it's been six weeks and we still haven't found Haldor in the reverse boss run. So that's basically my plan. If we get some spare time after finishing up in Stardew today, I'm going to go in and sail across the world in search for the merchant. Because apparently he doesn't bloody well want to be found. If he's hiding in all four corners of the earth, we'll just have to go get him. Steam has been buggy these last few days. It does seem a bit. I know they've been releasing a few updates recently too, so I don't know if they caused it or if they're fixing the problem. What do we have? Oh! Stardew tomorrow as well. I forgot Stardew Mondays. Actually, I have a really weird one. Speaking of games not synchronizing with the cloud, there's a game called House Flipper. Now, the reason I don't understand why it's not synchronizing with the cloud is because the save file doesn't contain much more than. I guess it contains, like, if you actually have any houses, those have to be saved as well. But it more or less contains like the level, or your character level, character money. Pardon me. Like House Flipper isn't an open world game or like you can't do anything in there except renovate a house. So the fact those files aren't uploading is bizarre to me. I might have to double check I've not left the folder in a read-only state or something silly. Because there is a chance if the save files share a directory with like a config file, there's a good chance I made the config file read-only. If not the entire directory, and I'll have to double check. Because they, they've been stuck ending upload for at least three months now. Since almost start of the year I noticed that. One solution I'm thinking of trying is running the game and making a new save. Isn't it? So close to getting the treasure too. new music really makes me want to play a sim city it's so bizarre that that once like the whole soundtrack is lovely i love sim city 3000 soundtrack but the menu music just really finds that specific brain worm that makes me want to play the game it's so bizarre the rest of the soundtrack doesn't 
It's just good listening. But the main menu music is like, I have to play the game. Oh. sleeping. Mm. What do you think about the floor floor design over here? Do you think it looks good or do you think it I don't know like it should be something different? Let me have a look. like it. I think I'd like to put them under the casks though. This oh yeah, I'm gonna, I, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna remove, I'm gonna remove this cask. They're not gonna be here. I have yeah, different okay. plans for this place. And yeah, in that case, I really, I, I think that looks good. I just noticed it's gone. You think I would have noticed sooner? I was watching Valley play Deep Rock before stream today too. And, uh, it's like if you put. You can put up to seven workbench around them, and uh, you can just—you don't have to have that item in your inventory. That's why I just relocated it and put some things around. So yeah. if you want to make something, just go up to the workbench and yeah. Definitely much more useful up there. I just made it because I wanted to see how it worked. There, so, getting used was no complaints yeah, here. It's really useful. <laughs> Yeah, Valley was playing some Deep Rock today with Flicky again. Really, really made me want to open the game. I do like Deep Rock. I just, I want to get back into it a bit more and try and remember all of the stuff I used to do. Because it feels like I forgot so much about playing the game. I want to know what black magic formula devs have put on that game to make it so addicting. Chicken. PC went poop. T-Rex, we patch Muto and we patch Chucken. Don't eat the void egg. Oh, we have so many eggs.
having to relearn what's where is interesting. Right, that is the exit done for now. Well, oh, balance, guys, has advanced far from me. Yeah, that's one of the reasons I think uh, I was suggesting double XP missions yesterday because I know that'll jump you up pretty quickly as well. So if you if you hunt for double XP missions, you'll be again. I need to remember. I spent like a hundred hours in the game within the space of a month. I learned everything, but not enough. Like you know how teachers always say you need to repeat things in order to actually, you know, like, keep repeating it. Recite your timeless tables thing, that's the point being. The reason you keep re repeating things you want to remember is because that repetition does help with the remembering part. Learning something once, not, like, for, like, a very short period of time and then dropping the game entirely, I've forgotten everything. Let's sit here and wait for the eggs. We only have three left. But... <laughs> it looks like they're on a plate. Ah! I knew we shouldn't be waiting long. But this is the thing, I need to actually properly remember, because I- a double XP is red XP. I don't remember if double XP is blue XP or not. Separate to- it's like, okay, so again, that's separate to the season progress as well. Performance points are another number entirely. So you've got three numbers you need to keep track of. Character level is the red XP. Whatever character you pick... Ooh. Whatever character you pick gets red XP. You as the player get blue XP, and then season progress is for performance points. I'm not awake enough to be talking about numbers like this. Game is fun, playing it is fun. If there's one thing you should ever do, it's not listen to me for advice. Floor, so down we go. <laughs> uh, pickaxe. going to glints at some point today too. Some point ever. Oh, cup of 
tea and a cup of coffee. I need to wake up. Here I am talking about the possibility of going back to Valheim. At this rate, I'm not even going to make it out of the rest of Warlock stream. Saving the mule missions probably it's hard to pick a least favorite in Deep Rock, but that could be it. If there's any if there's any mission I would really not like doing the mule one, I mean, they're all fun though, right? They all let you shoot bugs, they all let you mine. The game itself is what's fun, but the framing is the missions, what they set you to do. If there was ever one I had to say was my least favourite, I think it would be Repair the Mules. I just remembered I need to get rice. He has shop is closed tomorrow. Why is it you remember to do these things the very moment you are no longer capable of doing them? I also have chicken here going cold. That's fine, I can eat it tonight while everyone's sleeping. Something else that's going cold that's a bit more drastic than chicken is this cup of tea that I've let go cold. Nothing beats a piping hot cup of tea. This one's still warm. It's not as bad as a lukewarm cup of tea. You had KFC for dinner as well. And no warlock mentioned he had KFC for leftovers from yesterday. Original recipe, but you prefer spicy? I've never liked original recipe. Original recipe, every single KFC I've ever been to, original recipe always has the driest uh, chicken. An oyster? Just let me know. I actually should have a couple in my fridge. Okay, so just if, if I mean if you if you can just drop it in the right click on the watering pond and just drop it in the watering pond if in the pond? Sure. You yeah. You don't it doesn't have to be like a like a any quality one, just normal one will do. you had leftover KFC. I do, yes, and you reminded me of it about it. Do you do you ever get original recipe? No. Because oh, they have this okay. thing, like they have Oh you, you you mean the original recipe of the KFC, right? Yeah, KFC original recipe. No, I mean it's a big secret. They have a whole thing around it. Is that a joke that I did not get? <laughs> Sorry, 11 secret herbs and spices. Um, original recipe is the name of like the, like the, the main chicken you get, I think. I think, oh, I think we don't, I mean, we have fried chicken, we have different kinds of fried chicken and like the, then the big yeah. wings and stuff. But, but they have one, I'm trying to think of what language barriers might there be. So they have one called Classic. I'm not really sure. I'll check, but 
I mean, classic, yeah. I mean, there, sh there should be one called classic because I think classic is something which we find in most of the. I mean, if you go to if you go to, if you go to McDonald's, there is something called a classic burger or something. If you go to Burger King, there is something called a classic burger. So I guess there is a classic, but I've never heard. Yeah, I've I've only heard the original recipe. I think I've only heard that. Yeah, just like you know, the original recipe. Like they, it's the it's it's a Spice Girls and some other accounts. I mean, other other things. I mean, it's weird. I, I'm I'm sorry. I'm not being able to explain it. No, that's in the mind. But it's I've like KFC searching. on Instagram. They're right now following only like they only follow a bunch of people, and some of them are like uh, they're following the band members of the Spice Girls, and yeah, that's it. And some of the random. They're people. following Spice Girls now. So the joke is that, that makes mm -hmm. sense. Yeah, it just clicked as soon as I said it. Yeah, the, the joke is that like yeah, like the Spice Girls are in KFC. I don't know how that translates. <laughs> With uh, yeah, secret, secret spices, yeah. Yeah. Well, over here, and I suppose where Tone is as well, they have one of the menu items is called Original Recipe. It's just the regular, I would say the regular menu item. So it's the one that has those 11 secret herbs and spices. But we were, uh, we were talking about how it's always so dry. I guess I've had that. <clears throat> I mean, I, I guess I've had that. It's it's the basic fried chicken. Yeah. Then like, yeah. I mean, yeah, the, the, the classic or something like that. I mean, then there are different things like you know the hot and spicy one. Then uh, then there are like the strips. I love the strips. Oh, the boneless strips. And then so there are wings. Is the classic are, like, is the classic chicken dry for you as well? Because over here it is Again, terribly this is, dry. This is something which depends on the. It, this is something which depends on the outlet because I have had dry KFC. I've also had like KFC, which is really nice. I guess it. It all depends on. Uh, yeah, it, it depends on. Okay. Yeah. So the dryness of the chicken it depends on the outlet. Like. I uh, I I. Chicken. How long has it been in the freezer? Everything else. That's a fair point because I know KFC over here is like the worst chicken you can get it's like speed raised fattened up by the age it's like they i think kfc in my area they were recently like outed for using chickens that are barely a month old when it usually takes about three months for a chicken to get to full yeah, age like, yeah, yeah that's that's uh, i i mean that's yeah the poultry oh. thing, the, the poultry farm the chickens from poultry farm they're 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 bred to be like if you, if you go to like most of the poultry from chicken they can they can never fly, but if you go to like a farm like a farm farm, the chickens can fly like you know over a little distance like they can fly a little bit. That's because they, that's healthy chickens can fly. So the the ones that like KFC and other things or like the poultry chickens they are bred differently so that they grow up very fast and like yeah they have minimum bones more meat stuff like that like it's in a way think about this the the wagyu beef it's like it's not in the same way but it's like mm. the cow is treated very well so that there is nice marbling in it it's it's kind of similar but then it's way more harsh to how the chickens have to deal with it because it's something i'd not I'd never thought about the fact chickens and KFC basically mistreats their chickens um, by design, I guess, at this point, since they breed them for it. I but guess. it's not something I'd ever considered. Like, maybe that's the reason KFC chicken sucks, at least here. It's never been a highlight to go to KFC in my area. But that was the curiosity. I, um, since you mentioned you had KFC, I was curious whether or not it was different for you as well because um, oh, the turn one, the one, I mean I, like the one that is close to my place it's really it's pretty good the one like I had a few bad experiences but then this one is I, I got lucky with this one I mean it, I, I like this place this place I mean yeah. I, can, okay. I, I can switch between Burger King I don't have a good pizza place around me I mean I have some they're not, I'm not, they're not bad but yeah 
It's good, but it's a bit pricey. It's yeah. Okay. <laughs> Hello. No, um, natural chickens can fly. Chickens can fly. KFC chickens are bred not to fly. So you'll find KFC chickens will be bred to grow up super quick, get super fat, and they can't fly. If you go, like, if, say for example you go to Rhode Island and you look at any of the natural Rhode Island species of chicken, I dare say a few of them will actually be capable of flight, because chickens can. They're not a flightless bird. It's just that mass production of food has made them incapable of oh, flying. Did you, find the did you find an apple in the in the thing? In the I did. I am so glad I picked that up this morning. Now we only need ten wheat. Oh, uh, we needed something else, right? No, we just need ten wheat. Oh. Just for that one. What did we have in the box? One. We need Mine. nine. So I should go get the seeds. Okay. Little head fern. Little head fern, red cabbage as well. The red cabbage is. It should be done. It should be. It's in the greenhouse. It should be done. Okay. Wait, hang on. I'll, ch I'll go check on it. I was actually watching a little video that it, it, the video wasn't about chicken and food production, but it had a rant on it. Very much like me. I'm not here to rant and ramble about topics, but I just happen to get into them. Case in point, I'm also now ranting about chickens. So, you've never heard of, um... Oh shoot, what's it called? Ra... 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 Rhode Island has a lot of natural species of chicken that grow there. I think they even have one named after the island itself. R H O D E Islands, it's spelled. But I did a. I, I, that's one of the weirdest things to remember from elementary school. It was like grade three or grade four. I did a pamphlet on chicken species from Rhode Island. Pia is closed on Wednesdays. I'm going to Georgia to get nine, right? Oh, you can I buy. I forget Georgia's even there, but yeah, nine. I mean, I have, to, I have to spend more money, but it's fine. I'm thinking of going and spending a thousand dollars on rice. Why do you need rice? Oh, um, um, oh, you made a sushi roll for the community center, didn't you? Yeah, yeah. Maki roll, right? Yeah, so it'd just be for me eating. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it's, it's odd. I've already given it to the community center, so if you have some on you... You can consume it. I think you get fishing from Maki Rolls, I'm not really sure. Oh, that would be nice. No, I don't think you do. I think you just... The trout soup is plus one. There's something called a lost lobster bisque, but I, I don't think we have the recipe for that yet. Oh yeah, I did a paper in grade four on Rhode Island chicken species. White sauce. And... I wonder what kind of things they use. You must know, right? Have you ever no. tried a bisque? Like, are you talking in the game, or...? I mean, in general, I mean, in game, yeah, no. but in general, I'm, I'm like, most of the things in this game, like, they're based on real life items, right? So, I, I'm guessing lobster bisque is a thing, or any kind of. I, I've heard of lobster paste, but I know, see, um, in my area, there's a popular sauce called seafood sauce, which is actually just ketchup, mustard, and mayo. Oh, that sounds good. I mean, I, I guess that's a popular thing. I mean, that goes with a lot of things. A lot of places have that combination. Mustard, mayo, and ketchup. That's what he said, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's pretty pork. 
No fiddlehead ferns, by the way. Honestly, it's probably one of the better things you can do is find out how to get a natural bred chicken that isn't one of these factory poultry chicken is probably a good term to avoid. You Just raiding the fridge. I'm sorry. <laughs> Were you just raiding yeah. the fridge? Yeah, I just got one oyster up there. Oh, I forgot to give that back. Cockle oyster. Mm -hmm. Oysters are the green ones. Missing. Sell the rest, right? I need rice. Jojo Mod sells rice. Doesn't it? There's a dwarfish helmet. Uh, can we give that to the dwarf? Uh, no, but you can give that to the museum. I'm very lucky in the sense that I have a local butcher who sources, like, they, they provide, it's, <clears throat> sorry, let me start from scratch. I'm very lucky that I have a local butcher in my area because they pride themselves on high quality meat and produce and they sort of have to. Um, oh, fascinating. I've never seen that work before. But they sort of have to. Um, one of the... One of the reasons they pride themselves on high quality animals and get naturally bred animals as well, not the not the, not the poultry's ones you would get from like a supermarket or from KFC, is because they're like, they actually enter competitions. The butcher will enter his meats and, and cuts and sausages and all sorts into these competitions and win. It's it's not for nothing. The award-winning butcher, might I say. Um, but no, it, it's, it's nice to know I have someone in the area who actually does 
properly get his ingredients and produce, not only from local farmers, but from people that aren't buying and selling min-maxing profit kind of farmers. It's also a weird... It's a weird thing to think about, though. Like, the time it takes for a chicken to grow up. I guess, in some sense, if you're going to look at it purely from the perspective of a chicken costs you money, the longer it's alive, then yes, you'd save money from cutting a chicken down from, 30, uh, from 3 months to 30 days. But, if you just have, like, think of it like a cycle, right? If you buy 30 chickens month one, then let's say January, then by March they'll be grown. So if you buy 30 chickens in January, they'll be grown by March. If you buy 30 chickens in February, they'll be grown by April. Growing them in a month, growing them quicker, I suppose makes the turnover shorter, but I don't understand, like, there's no real necessity for it as far as I can tell. You would just have to have, perhaps, she would have to accommodate more chickens total, especially when dealing again. I'm talking about companies that are min maxi on profits, where they don't care about where the cuts come from, they just want you to cut costs. Nasty chicken. Apologies. Speaking of nasty chicken, to finish the sentence out loud, I warm some up to snack on.
Do we have something that we can give to the Luau thing? You know what? We don't. We don't. Both of us. We don't need to. No, no, no. Do not. Do not. No, no, no. Wait, bird. Oh, I was going to remove that and get the pathing down. It's fine. We can do that next time. I mean, you can go. You know what? Like, I think you should go ahead and attend the luau. I'll just keep decorating the place a little bit. Oh, you're right. Did you get the thing that we're going to give over there? I mean, let's go. I don't have anything on me, I just... Get a golden strawberry or something, it's fine. Golden white? Oh, the wild plum. Do we not have any strawberries? Okay, so no golden ones. Yeah, that's sad. So this is what the campfire is used for. I always did wonder. Did you add it to the thing or you're talking to people? Okay. I put the plum in here. Should I start the thing, the cutscene? Unless there's anything to do, I'm happy to start. No. Nope. That's a bit of a waste of a day if that's the only thing. Yeah. like perfect ingredients you can get for the potluck but I've never known anything about it. I mean iridium quality if any good thing it usually gives you the best response. You can I you know what I wanted to put in Lewis's shots in the soup. That really starts a funny response. <laughs> yeah you can do that. That's actually a thing in the game. something in I think we both have to put something in oh well it's a waste of a day I forgot about that I mean I, I don't think I no, I, I did not know that no I, well, I no thought idea. one thing would have been fine yeah I didn't even bring anything I could have put in like a floor tile or something <laughs> can you put anything in there So what, Stardew Valley's yearly lure is just bland every year until we show up, I guess. I guess. 
And this guy is always here. He's like he he he's like I, I don't know. He's like a big mayor or something. But he he's always like out here. He's waiting for some soup. Melon should be ready by tomorrow at least. Yeah, hopefully. We should have enough hardwood for you. Hmm? I'm sorry? We should have enough hardwood for you to get the upgrade you wanted too. What did I want? I completely forgot what upgrade I wanted. Oh, your your horse, I think. That's that's what I wanted again. Off to bed? No worries, Tone. We'll either catch you sometime tomorrow. Probably will, because I'll be streaming more Stardew with Warlock tomorrow. Otherwise, I'll see you in your next stream. I just noticed <laughs> we've kidnapped Jonathan Raymaker's Discord seems today. things I want to do but I think more than anything without more coffee I just think I want to sleep we should get halfway through summer which is not bad I just got to it. It did take a while, actually, the black loading screen. Yeah. <laughs> Does it load fine for you? I'm kind of curious if I'm the only one just getting stuck. No, I mean, I was stuck there as well. Are you stuck on the waiting for two players bit though? That's um... Yep. I usually get stuck like loading in. You know the part before it shows you how much you sold everything for? That's where I got stuck last night. Waiting for other player? I mean it says waiting for other player and then I think something happens. It does say that on both sides actually now you mention it, doesn't it? Torches. You've, you've started making the island look yep. really, really good. What have you been planting? Star fruits. Yep. Ah. 
I mean, you should. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm making, I'm growing all this thing just for the wines. If you want, you can just uh, grow some more melons and stuff, or I don't know, something else that you like cauliflowers or something that you just want to sell for money. Not a stuff I find fishing. But I'm not really in any pinch for money at the moment. Okay, that's fair. I thought they would be. We need to go and spend a thousand dollars on rice. Then we need to go get these. Wait, we did go get the geodes processed. Buy the rice and then I don't really know. I wonder how much a thousand dollars will get us in rice. an artisan good. We're just gonna help Warlock get $20,000 in a single night. I'm gonna start putting geodes here. I need a place to put them. And then when we get a fair amount we'll get onto Clint and get them processed. Coffee! 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 Flicky to do my cover of imagination. What are you yelling at me for? Two hundred each. So five is a thousand. Okay, we're not buying five. Okay. Wow. So there's a motivator to make rice. I'm not burning thousands of dollars on the damn stuff. make some like I okay we have to sell one of the maker rolls just to find out if that's profitable if you get 
every other piece of the Mako roll except the rice and you buy the rice, is it still profitable? Because I think the answer is going to be no. I think we're going to get about 120 per Mako roll. Let's find out, though. Lower the gates. It does use for my inventory first, right? It's only in descending order. important to note though, in descending order. So if the fridge is going to be called upon in descending order, we would want iridium, silver, gold, sorry, iridium, gold, silver in descending order in that manner too. Or do we just sell everything that isn't playing? That would be gold, silver, it's messy looking, unless we do that, we could have seafood, gold, silver, plain, but I don't like that, grotty. Suppose we can still go through ascending order. We'll sell one. What does it give? 100 energy and 45 health. It's not bad. change of music soon anyway. I'm gonna switch over to a different playlist at the end of the day. Just for a bit of variety. Sounds and uh... I may have a book. I don't need to do anything. Actually AFK fishing. This is the worst thing for me right now. I need to fight a fish. I need to get a knife out. Start swinging. Proper AFK fishing, I'm just. I'm gonna end up falling asleep in my chair.
Silent and serene fishing while Ford falls asleep at her desk. Nine hours. Falling asleep at nine hours. I mean, let's think, right? Okay, so I've been awake for 13. Is that a bad amount of time? Very. Okay, I also. I need to remember this game curses me to fall asleep a lot of the time too. I have the worst record staying awake playing Stardew Valley. Green up. Like, is 13 hours a long time? The work day is something like 9 to 5. So, if the regular full time work day is 9 to 5, how long do most people what what's what's everyone's standard day awake? You stay awake for 12 hours, 14, 16? Do you somehow avoid sleeping entirely? There's one coffee down. Okay, so I sold a maker roll to find out if it's even profitable after buying the rice. You get 20 gold profit. The maker roll? Yeah. I mean, if yeah, you buy the rice, it's only time. 20 gold. I'm sorry? If you buy the rice, it's only 20 gold profit. You get 220, but the rice costs 200 each. Yeah, I mean, selling fr crops in this game, I've seen it's not very profitable. I mean, sorry, my bad. Um, selling food in this game is not very profitable, I've seen. Oh, we have the red cabbage, by the way. Nice. Do we ever get large duck eggs? No, we don't. I was gonna say... These ducks are almost at the five hearts and they're still refusing to lay a large duck egg. Yeah, they always, they always, forever and ever after they only make that. Uh, hey Flicky. How are you today? How was your nap? And I put it in the wrong chest. Would you like an egg on a plate? Then I offer you an egg in these trying times. I'm gonna have to... I'm going to have to look up. Meme. I think Icky sent me the meme. About Deep Rock. And I like Deep Rock. Can you tell him? I mean, there are some sleepy? crazy runs that people do. I was watching someone do a run where you're only allowed to sell pizza. So the main challenge is to get the first pizza because you're not allowed to sell anything else. Oh, yeah, how do you get pizza if you don't have an income? Yeah, I mean, you have to you have to keep checking the trash can and then go to sleep. That's so, how you find your first 
actually. You, you, you can't sell anything except pizza, but can you do missions? I mean... Mm, I mean, like, what kind of mission does gives you pizza? No, uh, money. That sends you pizza. If you, if you do missions for money, then you could get other sources of income. Well, I guess, like, I mean, no, I guess that's not allowed because then you're not just a pizzeria. You're doing other things, right? What are you in? So, is that literally it? You just keep checking Gus's bin and going to sleep? Yeah, and also, like, if you if you have enough money, if you can save enough money to... I don't know how profitable it'll be, but if you just become friends with Gus, then he sends you some... Uh, like, he will send you pizza on the mail. You can, you can, you can go that route. I better hope Gus enjoys some kind of fish or some kind of foraged item, I suppose. Uh, he likes orange. So yeah, it's not the easiest thing to get. I thought people had like 10 things they liked each. Yeah, something like that. I mean, there are other things, but I think orange is the easiest thing for Gus. Ooh. What are you, yeah, what's Thor having for dinner? I'm sorry? The topic change. What's Thor having for dinner? What's who? For Warbler. In your chat. Yeah, yeah, I'm Oh, I, I, it took me a minute to see that. But like, Thor, yes, what, what are you having for dinner? I mean, I think she did mention it earlier, but... I must have missed it. I must have missed it. I mean, I don't know. I, I remember reading it. Wait, hang on, what was it? It was something amazing, I remember. We talk about food so much, right? Like it, it, I, I, it's, sometimes it's hard to get track of like what food we were talking about. I'm using a bunch of the wood that we have here for making decoration things. Like, That's bad, yeah. we have something like 400. Yeah, we have tons of wood actually. That's why I'm just using a bit to make things. We can put it there, right? Oh, we can. What the hell? I don't know. Maybe I'll just keep the green there. I don't know. How does it look to have all this thing? Oh. <laughs> I really wonder sometimes if I... I know I slur my words, especially when I'm tired. And I'm probably in the worst position right now to be speaking coherently. It's a bloody crapshoot with me whether or not I speak too quick or just all asleep mid sentence. Uh, there is no middle ground with me. It's either I'm she's talking. Having she's having she's having yellow rice with chicken. Yes, she did mention that earlier today. Nice. Ah, it sounds lovely. That, yeah, it, it does. I mean, okay. So I mean, I know you have to go and get the food, but I'm wondering, like, when you when you say yellow rice, what is the yellow coming from? Is it is it like turmeric? Is it saffron? What gives the yellowness to the rice? What kind of spice are you adding? I mean, I guess it's a very detailed procedure. You cannot just explain that in a few lines. I imagine it. Turmeric's the only one I can think of, but I'd be curious if it was something different. Which one? Turmeric. Turmeric, right, yeah. I mean, I guess... So there's something called... Sa uh, okay, saffron, right? You can also use saffron water to give some, like, like some biryani, some pulao. Ooh! Saffron water. Yeah, like it's it's like a very fragrant thing. It smells amazing. Oh, I've never cooked with saffron. It, it's a bit out of my price range to know, to yeah, know what I'm saffron doing. With rice, yes. it, it, that, that's what she's doing. Saffron with rice. So you use like yeah, you use you use you, you put the saffron in water overnight. You let it be there, and then you use the saffron water. I mean the saffron as well. But yeah, it makes it very fragrant among other things. is a little bit out of my price range. I, it, well, I, I I should rephrase. I have no idea what I'm doing with saffron. And it's one of those things that 
to be blind and clueless. It's not the sort of spice you put money into. I feel like saffron has always been one of those things you have to know what you're doing or else you're not going to get anything out of it. But I could be wrong. The fact that it is so expensive, I think it is the most expensive, one of the most expensive things in the world by weight category. You end up paying supermarket listed at something like a thousand dollars per gram or more, depending on what brand you get. And bear in mind, like the cost, the literal cost difference between brands, you get like three tiny bits of saffron in a packet. The actual cost difference is maybe something like 20 to 30 cents, but it weighs so little that you're dealing with massive multitudes. By the time you get to grams weighing of saffron, you're dealing with thousands and thousands of dollars of the stuff. But I would be so clueless in what I'm doing with the, with the saffron I don't dare buy it. If I had a recipe book, it's the kind of... I never follow recipes, context, but I feel like if I'm ever going to cook with saffron, that would be the one time I follow the recipe to the tea, like absolutely 100%, no variation, actual genuine measurements up to like the gram, I would be so specific because I, I'm so laissez-faire, I, is that, can you apply that term elsewhere? I'll have to google the definition in a little bit, but I am, I'm carefree, definitely, absolutely carefree with how I cook. And I think that is probably the opposite of what you need when dealing with saffron because you get so few sprigs of saffron per purchase. It's definitely something on my to-do list is to taste test saffron, find out what the deal is, find out why it's one of the most coveted and highly praised, praised, highly expensive spices out there. I guess I think the last thing we will need is the purple mushroom because wheat is growing right now. We'll get the fiddle hemp farm before summer ends. We cannot be that unlucky. I mean, it's Saturday. I'm going to check the secret forest for the fiddle hemp farm. If I can find this mushroom floor, all we need is the one purple mushroom. But I've not had any luck finding it. I mean, yeah. It's somewhere in the hundred floors worth of cave, so I suppose the chance of just thumping across it is pretty low. Yeah, I mean, it has to be a little bit lucky. You have to get lucky with that. Expense of a CD room. Mm -hmm. Get over here. 
reading the wrong chat. This is Warlock's chat. What are you casting that way for? Nice. So yeah, I think we only need the purple mushroom and the wheat is growing. to recoup some of my expenses from the beach today. I'm sorry? I went to recoup some of my expenses from buying all that rice at the beach today. Why did you buy the rice? I mean, are you doing some science? Making mecha rolls. I mean, what? I, 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 hmm. Are you going to sell them? Are, are you doing oh, it for no. money? Or do you have a quest no, no, no. That's like the worst way to make money. I just eat them. I just feed them, okay. I mean, you can buy them. I effectively did. How much do they cost at Gus's? I'm not really sure. They tell me much less than $200. It's a bit rich for this rice. But... Uh, uh, do you want me to sell all this artisan product? Yeah, yeah, go for it. You've got the artisan beast. I mean, why? Why did, you should have it by now. I'm level 9 sure. or something. Damn. What one do I need? Farming? Yeah, level 9 farming. Yeah, farming. So th that's that's why I, I keep telling you to grow something. All I need to do is harvest both the crops. This harvest should be enough, actually. Yeah, it most definitely should be right. level 10. Do we, we need a rainbow shell. I just remembered to grab that back up. Oh, I'm dead. I mean, seven just shy of. So, not so bad. We need new music. We need new music. We've had this song on for this album on for too long. Harvest, harvest all this. Oh yes, it's harvest day, isn't it? One of the harvest. I think I'm going to... I have time. I guess I'm not going to grow any more uh, star fruits. I guess I'm just going to make... grow some... what is this thing called? Uh, I'm going to grow some melons. If this doesn't get me to level 10, I'll be surprised. It should get into level 10. How much money did you make from the artisan goods, by the way? Uh, 30,000. Nice. Not a bad day's work. Yeah. So if you need something, just let me know. Could be fine. I'm still sitting on 30,000 myself as well. I'm Thinking with all the extra wood supplies we have, I might go grab a house upgrade. I hope that would 
the second house upgrade is. It's kitchen, then something else before cellar, isn't it? Kitchen, then you have the, after kitchen, you, have, you can get the, the thing, the baby room. Not baby room first? Wow. Yeah. Because I think, I think the prerequisite, like you have to get married now. You don't have to get married, but yeah, that's the thing. Like, so even if you don't want the thing, I mean, you can make the thing and then get remove, uh, get rid of the the thing. Uh, what's it? What's it called? The baby bed. I forgot what it's called. Alright. Well, I'm just gonna put the star fruit in here. Uh, so you can you can actually bring the star fruit inside this this greenhouse. There's a box for all the things that is going to become wine and stuff inside the greenhouse. already have some apparently i have some uh the star fruits yeah i've been i've been turning I'll, I'll slowly turn this into like a ancient fruit farm but yeah in the meantime just growing some because the star fruits they're like yeah they're, they're like the like you know you can make the most money with star fruits the sweet gem berry it's actually like it sells for the most of my uh, mo like the most amount of money but then it's really hard to stock up on a lot of sweet gem berries. There's no real way to collect them. can go back. What else? Mushrooms need to go somewhere. What are we doing? Next to the train station, we have to put the rainbow shell in. Yeah, mushrooms can just go in the fridge. No reason why not. way to the train station has to be mines throw the shell into the box immediately a note falls down from the rafters above hold on your next task 
place ten beads inside Maya's fridge. This game has beetroot? Oh, this game has what? Beetroot, apparently. Beet? Do you mean beet? Yeah, you can yeah. find them at the Desert Trader. Uh, what's her name? Uh, Sandy sells some. She's nice. My next task to is to place 10 beets inside the mayor's fridge. In, yeah, inside the mayor's fridge. I haven't, I haven't, I haven't, like, I haven't even started growing them. If you're going to buy the seeds, can you just get 10 for me as well? Yeah. Um, I think I can head to the... Not at this point in time, I don't think. That tomorrow. I thought there was more grass here. Ah! All right. Oh, uh, are you down <laughs> south? If I'm up at the. I'm sorry, where oh. you are. I'm at the bath house. Oh, okay, okay. I will go check the dra the trader. This bath house has some impressive loot. Confused. I found an ornate necklace and I thought that was for a mission, but I can't find the mission anywhere. genuinely thought it was a mission I had. Right. Well, we have mixed seeds. How many do we have? Um, we have recipes to make packets of seeds. We have... Summer is a spice, a grape, and a sweet pea. Spice berry. 
great and a sweet pea. Mm. Probably not going to waste the grape. We'll at least plant these down. I'm out of coffee. Yeah. I found a necklace at the spa, and I swear I had a mission to go pick one up, but I don't see it anywhere in my mission log. I think you found a... Did you find a mission, or I think you found a secret note that's, that told you that someone lost their necklace? You're right, it was a secret note. Whose note? Uh -huh. I forgot. I have no idea. But you can check it in your collections thing. Borrowed a necklace from Mum. She lost it somewhere near the bathhouse. She's going to freak out if she notices it's missing. Apparently, I got out of bed to read that. So, someone's mum lost a necklace. I have no idea who would... <laughs> I don't know anyone in this game. So many people do the relationship thing. I just farm. I farm and fish. Go down the mines, fight things. Artisan goods for 40% more. There we go. I've got my artisan goods upgrade now. GG's. Yeah, now you can sell like cheese, wine, everything. Well, their crop's growing 10% faster. Like, if you think about how many crops you have at a time sensitive, like the strawberries. I mean... could be an extra strawberry. Yes, but then you have to think about it this way, right? Like, um... Hang on, let me think about this, but I was going to say something. Like... Like, you need, the, you need to grow the crop anyway. Like, you need to grow the crop anyway to get... You have to wait for the wine machines to finish preparing, right? So even if you have a lot of crops, it'll only like you'll only be making money because towards the end game, most money will come from artisan goods like pickles, jams, wine, stuff like that. You'll mm -hmm. still be selling crops, but then also how many crops are you? You like that is effective only if you're selling crops which are, you know, which harvest faster. I mean, sorry, which which gives you mul multiple harvest per crop. If that is the case, then multiple harvest will give you more money. Well, I guess, I mean, if you, if, if you, but yeah, did you go with the other one or which one? No. I mean, you can choose, we can, we can both have like each one so that like, you know, that way we can make the best of both worlds. I'm curious how the math works out though, because an extra set of strawberries at the end of spring could be thousands of money compared to so, what you get from I mean, the extra profit I am thinking margin. thinking of it this way. I'm thinking of it this way. Like, I'm just thinking of it from the first point of view from of the, like, the speedrunners. And the speedrunners, right? Whenever they have to do something like this, they always go for uh, artisan. Because, like, they actually did the math. I've not done the math. I wish I could tell you that, yes, I've done yeah. the math. I have not. I suppose yeah, if they've you... actually done the math. Other people that would know if anyone has done the math, it would be them. Uh -huh. I have forgotten what I was doing. Someone's mum needs that ornate necklace. I don't know who the parents are in this game. Is there a, like a family tree thing I can look up? I mean, in the game. Obviously there's probably a Wikipedia page somewhere with all the info. You 
or a mother? I mean, Ooh. you can put okay. down your egg machines, right? You can put down your mayonnaise machines inside the coop so that you can just immediately after collecting the eggs, you can put it in there. That yes. way we can open up some space down here. I'm sorry? It's a space thing that I'll move them, but it's no matter to me. No, I, mean, I, I, I don't need that space. I don't need that space. I was just thinking about like, you know, decorating the place. But I, I, if you're doing your own thing, if you have a plan in mind, go for it. No, if you, I can move them if you want to put some floorboards no, down there. I, I, I don't, I don't, no, no, not floorboards. I was thinking about, yeah, I, I'm, I'm thinking about a place where I can move this, 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 this shed that I have. I just built a shed, but I'm unable to find that location. Well, I think I found it. Hang on. But we have to move all these boxes. Oh, it's gonna be a... It's gonna take a lot of time. How many people in this town have kids? I'm sorry? How many people in the town have kids? There's only two families, isn't it? Oh, really? Okay. Because the note only said mother. to anyone and thought about failure conditions I don't like this you am I allowed to give the necklace away do we both catch one or is there only one of these I mean even I mean you can always cancel a quest you don't have to finish a quest so you can you can yeah I was that's why I was thinking like I was going to Put Mayor's shorts on display, but then I forgot. Okay, it says wrong person. That solves so many problems. Okay. How many other people have kids? Is it the grandma? Where does grandma go during the day? Oh, grandma! No. How many? Okay. Do you have kids? Rina has kids. Okay. That's strange. I didn't even notice it was missing. Thanks for bringing it back. Alright. There you go, I guess. Wait. Decorates the floor of one room. As in one floorboard or the whole floor? I'll take that if it decorates my whole room. Let's give it a go. I should have sold some things back to him for a single floor. That seems too cheap. It's too good to be true. It only does one floor board, doesn't it? It's not the entire floor. I can sell artisan goods. I don't okay, I'm have to put down some in the chest. They're like, they're like just so that I can go and uh, I'm clearing out some space. Oh. It's a robotic voice. Congratulations, you have a 10,000 gold JoJo rebate waiting for you. Please mail your credit card number to 133 and Gonga Street, Zuzu City to receive your rebate. What a lovely cooler. Joe, welcome back. Does this work for the whole floor or just one square? Wow. My bedroom is now made of grass.
perfect monotone. I am putting a thing away. What am I putting away? Bedroom or natural. Quiet. It does quite look like carpet though, doesn't it? Carpet like grass. It's that same kind of texture. Let's, I'm let's... putting all the food from the box in your refrigerator. That's okay. I've got the mini fridge there with all the complete food. This really... Food. You've got the right spot. This really does look like grass over here, doesn't it? Ooh, it looks like what over where? Grass. It does. It's a. Uh, did you get that from Pierre? I did. Okay, that's nice. For some reason. That's nice. I'm. I'm it saving. It looked. I'm, I'm. I'm. I'm sorry. It, it, it looked a lot better as a single square in Pierre's shop, but seeing the whole room, I. I won't say I have regrets. And I do think whoever designed that carpet might need to be replaced by a better designer. I mean, I guess. Maybe you can put it down somewhere else. Like, you can put things down inside your barn and stuff. Yeah. That would be neat, actually. Grass in a barn would be a very interesting concept, mm -hmm. actually. And also, there's this thing that I have inside in front of my horse's house. It's called a hay floor. You can buy a bunch of floor uh, recipes from Robin, from the dwarf, all those things. This thing inside, this thing in front of my horse, you can use it for your barn. I don't know, it'll look like a different thing. Welcome in, Thor. Honestly. It has been so long since I've seen a shag rug anywhere. There used to be absolutely everyone and their dog owned a shag rug in my town way back in like the 2000s. 20 odd years ago. It was like the... I don't know if it was the in thing. To me it seemed like leftovers from the 90s. It seemed like everyone just had one. And then slowly but surely over the next half a decade into the 2010s, they all disappeared. No one had them anymore. Now they're super rare. You only ever see them used in antique shops in the, in the sort around town. It really does look like grass though. If it was in blue, just that one palette change, if the same texture was in blue, I think it would be fine. I'll have to live with it. Because there weren't any other better options as far as I can tell and you can't remove it. That's just it. Oh, we have to live with the green grass carpet. Ooh. Not a bit early. Oh, I was just lying to lie, I was just lying down in bed. You don't have to go to sleep. Oh. I mean, I didn't realize. I saw the I message you... and I I thought you were just out for the count for the day. No, no, no. I was just like, yeah, I was just lying down. Because you can click no and I you think. still get the stamina regen. I'm sorry? If you don't actually want to sleep, you can click no and get, still get the stamina regen. Oh, no, no, I was just I was, I was just lying down while I think about certain things, like, you know, designs. That I, like, how I want my floors to look like and stuff. You know, just lying yeah. down in bed. Just lying down in bed? Yeah, just lying down in bed, staring at the roof and just, like, uh, at the ceiling and just thinking about, like, you know, how to do this, how to do that. Got a new item in stock called the Auto Grabber. Then you can milk your cows and goats, shear your sheep and gather eggs, pluck your woolly rabbits all on its own. Consider a luxury item, so I'm charging 25,000. Funny. 
right. Evil chicken just spawned in in the back corner. Don't know if I should be scared. Uh, do you know where the hay is? Um, I put it all back in the silo, but we have ten spare. No, 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 sorry, not the hay, the wheat. It was in the blue chest, which is now missing. The blue chest. Hang on, where is it? I assume it's over in one of these now. No, these are these are the ones which I like. I got from the thing. These are the ones which I. These are the ones which are around the workbench. That those are the only ones which I got. Hang on, they'll be gone soon. Don't worry, because I have some wheat on me, so that's why I was like wondering. Okay, because the blue chest is gone, so I figured you moved it somewhere else. No, I have. Wait, how much wheat do I have on me? I have seven wheat on me right now. Trying to look. Um, unless it's in my fridge, maybe. Nope. Nope. I have genuinely have no idea then. It was in the blue chest. That was right here. Between the white and the plant. Now it's in none. Um, gems are still here, right? Yes. Not a clue. There was one wheat in there, but. Some goods. Should we go by the other flooring from Pierre and change the bedroom? I feel like we should. Are you at the farm right now, Bird? Do you see the the where the new shed is, or yes. is that only my end? No, no. Is it? Do you, it's where the horse used to be. Do you see the shed now? Yeah. Okay. So, do you think this is okay? I want to test something. Just go inside. Go inside. Are you gonna shift me across the farm? Walk out now. See what happened. Wow. <laughs> Right. Nice. <laughs> I don't know you could do that. That's so cool. But I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Put it back. Put a rainbow trout. Put it back. Okay. I'm kidding. I mean, I'm, you, you can catch the fish. They'll like, even if you catch the fish, they'll all grow back. You don't have to like do anything else. I mean, if, if, as long as there is one fish in the pond, they'll grow back. What are they asking for? They're asking for something. Uh, there's an exclamation point here. Bring two right, purple right. mushrooms. Oh. oh, we need the purple mushroom, don't we? Fish can give you a quest, apparently. We have learned things. But yeah, my question was like, I was wondering where to move this warehouse. This, 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 this shed is important, but I'm thinking where I can put it. Um, I can move the bin. Let me move the candy cane in the bin. 
And you should have enough space where the chests are. Like where you put it but in that little cubby hole. No, actually that 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 is good enough for the horse place, but it's uh, like one bit short for the for the warehouse thingy. Um. I'm just thinking. I just need some place to put this. So, so I mean, the problem is like you know, somewhere up here where where I have the beer statue, there's like a patch of soil which you cannot access for anything, which sucks to be honest. I'm thinking, where can I put this? I don't have any room up there. So I was thinking that doesn't work. So incidentally, out of my, I, I ran out of my cup of tea. Uh, would you like to go get another one? Do you want to restart the day? No, no, not immediately. We can do that overnight, though. If you wouldn't mind. Okay. No, no, no worries. I'm just trying to find a place for this this thing. But the moment I leave this menu, I'm gonna like Robin is heading out. I'm just holding her at the door. I mean, if you want, you can. If you have nothing to do, you, you can go for a coffee right now. I mean, a tea right now. Yeah, okay. I might do that actually. I'll go lie in bed. I mean, so if when you log out, I can I can hold time for you. I mean, if you, if you log. No, out. no, we're not doing anything like that. I'll just go lie down in bed for the day. I'll get bored with no, I mean, and I'll be no, back. No, no, listen, hear me out. Hear me out. Even if you're going for a few minutes, if you log out, time will stop right now, and I can. Oh, uh, and I you can, can plan the day. Menu. Yeah. I can, I can, yeah. I can. That should work. I've not done a whole lot today anyway. I don't risk losing much. That's fine. I mean, no, you, you I, what have you done today? Like, what have you done? I'm just thinking, like, if, if you've done something important, then we, oh, okay, you have quit. I'll be back in a second, though. Okay. In a bit. Only going to be gone for a cup of tea, so hopefully it won't be too long. I'll be back in a second. Don't go anywhere.
Ooh. If you are present, Joe. If you are present, this is the AFK music, the Skatebird soundtrack. Oh, right. Where's the warehouse placement? Well, it went well. I was, what kind of tea did you get? Just Yorkshire. Um, just a regular black tea with milk. Oh. 
How did I miss? Uh, nothing much actually. What were you doing before you left? <laughs> Wandering around almost aimlessly. I really don't think I did a whole lot except for collect the eggs, put the mayo in, picked up a couple of truffles, and that was about it. Okay. Wait, I wonder what happened to the truffles that I picked up. Do you still have- I should have them in your inventory. They're in the white chest in the barn. Oh, okay. Okay, so it's like, the work that I did, it's not gone. Oh, by the way, all the working things, the workbench and everything, they're in this building now. Is that too far, do you think? I don't use the workbench, that's fine with me. No, no, I mean all the materials will be... That's what, that's what I was thinking, that's what I'm saying. I can, yeah, no, I'm fine to work with that. No, I mean, because I have, I could not find another place to move this thing. And that's why, like, if you, if you want, you can move it somewhere. Hey, Molly, welcome in. Thanks for stopping by. I honestly, wow, that's a decent ring of light. Mine's so tiny. <laughs> There's another. I made the green. Yeah. Close. Let me have a look. Why even have the recipe? You should have. I do. Five eye and five solar. Oh, it's all over in the warehouse. Is there a, well? Is there anywhere else you'd like to put the warehouse? Um, I don't have any room. That's that sort of thing. I don't have any place for it. Yeah, this might be right back screen is still on, isn't it? By the way, I mean, I did not. You can you can catch the fish from the pond if you want. That gives you fishing XP as well. Catch and release, you mean? I'm sorry. Catch and release. How many are in there? Oh, five out of five. It tells you. Oh, did did you catch one already? No, I have no idea how any of this stuff works. What do you mean, like? You can just, yeah, just normally, you can just put the thing in and uh, wait for it to... The main thing is like, you know, you get some good loot from these things and this fish sometimes will give you like a prismatic shard as a drop. I'll have to move um, the rest of the things tomorrow because it's getting late. It is, isn't it? Thanks for letting me know, Marley, by the way. How are you doing this morning? This afternoon? This evening? This you know tonight? what? I'm gonna put the milk pail in the box so that, like, if you're if you if you're going to pet the milk, or I don't know, because if I'm not around, then the cows. Yeah, I'm just thinking if I should just go and get the auto grabber. Oh, the, yeah, I think I'm gonna. Go. Auto grabber would be better. If you want me to buy it, I can. I've got enough money for it. If you get the one for the chicken, I'll get the one for the animals. They each cost cost twenty five thousand. So if you get if you get one for the coop, I can get the one for the barn. Sounds like a plan. Is Marnie open today? Yeah, I mean yeah. Doing well. It's about five twenty three p.m. Hope you had a lovely day. I was planning to switch back to Valheim. I don't know what time Warlock's planning to finish up in Stargy though. We do also have Stardew. <laughs> We've double booked. We have Stardew with Warlock today, and we have Stardew with Warlock tomorrow. Um, because we had an open slot. 
Overall, the super best boss run with Jonathan Raymaker and Warlock and Fractured Chris, and we just transitioned over here into Stardew. That's a nice seamless way to continue the day, since both of us are still going to be streaming anyway. I know Warlock would be on Stardew regardless, but I normally have my Stardew Monday for me, so today's a bit of an extra stream on Stardew. My plan was if Warlock ever ended stream and went off and did something else, that I was going to go back to Valheim and do a bit of sailing, because I think that would be a nice chill way to end the day. Although, that is also while remembering sailing can hold me hostage until I find land that is safe to make port at. Do I dare s okay, no, the premise alone main is the answer is yes. Do I dare spend a thousand dollars on two pixels you can barely see? Yes. But I'm not wearing it. <laughs> Why did you buy it? <laughs> because it's two pixels. That's five hundred dollars a pixel. That's primo quality right there. Primo price, primo quality. That's how it works. If it's expensive, it must be worth it. It's a consumerist mindset. Mm -hmm. Glad you finally got to catch a stream. It's... It's an odd time slot, because I normally stream London time. I've got a gotten myself into a bit of a situation where everyone I normally stream with lives in London or Asia somewhere along those lines. As a result, I wake up at midnight, I then have about four or five hours-ish to get ready, eat something, grab a coffee, wake up properly, and then sit down and start stream. Which is all fine. Uh, but that's a massive time switch. Like waking up at midnight and then I usually stream for about eight hours, I would say. Then I, and, and that's it. I, eight hours, I normally finish at about midday my time or something like that. Because I usually start at about four through to 12. And I, yeah, five a.m. So you'd be Eastern Standard Time. I mean, you can always go to Robin and change the layout if you think that something is different or something if you want something differently. I'm just putting it no, down for the time being. How do I buy the auto feeder? Uh, you just go to Marty oh, and then... it's just a placeable object. Yeah. I can afford two. I'm gonna grab yours. Uh, yes, grab mine and then I'm gonna send you the money through Lewis right away. This is a story all about how my time zone flipped upside down and I'd like to take a minute just sit right there and tell you why I stream at midnight. Pacific Standard Time. There we go. And I'm afraid if that cover of the song wasn't enough of an explanation in and of itself, I'm not going to elaborate. Have such stamina? I live off a of caffeine. Where does this go? How does the auto grabber work? If I put it here at the door, you still have to come in and put it grab it. Barn. No, yeah, you have to you have to collect it from the from the thing. Alright, this one can go over in the barn. Looks like no truffles today. Oh, just two.
Ah, right. That sorted. Wow, thank you. You're welcome. That's it's twenty five k, right? Yeah, that was that was the uh, that's for the auto feeder. Mhm. Mm the auto grabber. No, the auto grabber is twenty five k. Yes, right? yes, the auto feeder. Yeah, it was. French, fresh, French, <coughs> the fresh rinse of Bordeaux. And hey, look, if you really like Stardew Valley, I'm going to take this opportunity to, I've, I've not shouted out anyone tonight that I've been streaming with, but Morlock has been on the Stardew Valley binge, so if you do want more I was going to say, Bouncy, you better not be sleeping. If you want more Stargy Valley, or even just more chill streams to check out in your downtime, Warlock is definitely the place to go. They're currently live right now, with the stream here. But if you ever get a moment otherwise, definitely go say hello. They do play, uh, as I think briefly said just before too, they also play Valheim on Sundays with us, the reverse boss run. Catch up with my own brain here. It's a, it's a lovely stream to hang out in. Salmon berry, shall I? 120 of the things. So, how much do we need to get the cellar in both of our houses? A lot. And I think we have to get married first, I'm not really sure. Wait, you're literally not allowed a cellar until you get married? Yeah, I'm not really sure about that. But it's like it's like hundred thousand for each house. Ooh. Ouch. in circles. It's 6 p.m. I've done nothing all day. Um, where's the star fruit? Greenhouse. Actually, we could switch the warehouse and my house around, can't we? Yeah, we can. I, yeah, we can definitely do that. Can I could live in the south. Yeah, I think that would be an idea, because then having the warehouse between us is probably less annoying than running past my house to reach the warehouse. Yeah, so if you want to do that, maybe just like, because I think the warehouse is slightly bigger, so you, you might have to move this black box. Maybe move a few of those things. Oh no, all of my stuff I'll be moving with the house. I'll take the whole lot with me. No, no, the boxes. Like, you cannot, even if you're moving the house, the chests outside your house, right? Yeah, I'll be moving them. Uh, They'll come with me. Okay. 
Okay. So, um, the black one needs to move for you to place the warehouse down, though. Yes, the black one, and I think I'm just yeah, the black one. I'm not really sure. I'm just thinking. I think the black one and some of your that 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 path in front of your house that as well, I guess. Just that for decoration. Go to the sprinklers just in case. And all right, we can do that tomorrow. If it doesn't fit, I'll be surprised. It should fit. Shouldn't be much problem. How do you move a house? You go to Robin's and... So the menu where you have the build option, just over there you'll find... Uh, you'll find... I think it's called relocate or something like that, but it, basically that's what it does. It just moves the house or any other building that you put down, your shed or anything. Moves everything. All the fruits are all the fruits and I think all the veggies as well because I I will make a box outside for all the veggies uh, but right now all the fruits and everything they're inside the greenhouse Oh, we have 10 wheat. Nice. Uh, that's it, isn't it? That's the community center done. Uh, did we get the blue mushroom? I think that's... Yeah, I think that's... Okay. Mushroom cave. Right. I searched for mush in Google Drive because I thought that's where I kept the file. I had a file I made for my main save, but the only save I have that's in year two. And all I did was write down where I found the mushroom floor and I was tracking it. I wanted to know whether or not I could actually use that same file. But uh, it's not in my Google Drive, apparently. I think it's different for every save, right? I mean, for I every save, it's a unique so. thing, but I think it's yeah. different. Yeah, it's different for every save. I can't even find the file in the first place. What do you mean? Like, you, you don't have it on... At least not in Google Drive. What do you mean on Google Drive? Do you, do you not have it on your Steam? Text file? No. The what file? I, I, I'm sorry, I, I thought you were looking for your... What are you looking for? A text file. For, for the mushroom. Text file. What, what does that text file contain? I wrote down what day it was and what floor the mushroom floor was on. And I followed oh, the pattern. Okay. I, thought, I thought for some reason you were looking for your game save in Google Drive. Like, how is... No, no, I've got a text file where I was tracking the mushroom floor. But I can't find it. It's not. I mean... Mm. I don't know. I don't even have a folder that's called Stardew. That's so sad. We can also buy it from, I mean, if, if you keep on top of the lady. Uh, what's yeah, that? I might head down yeah. there. The trader lady, yeah. It's only on Fridays and Sundays. I'm like, I'm trying to remember every Friday and Sunday to check the inventory. But yeah, I haven't seen it so far. What?
mushrooms. So they can be found in the mines from level 81, the mushroom caves, the mushroom ca uh, the mushroom floors. As per wiki. <laughs> right, so are you moving the house today? Yeah, I'll go move my house, you move the warehouse. We'll switch places. Okay. Oh, no, I can move the warehouse first, since we cleared space for it. When does Robins open? couple of hours in the mines I, mean, I think i think you have to be there at the same time because unless you move your house i cannot move the warehouse unless i move the warehouse you cannot move your house i mean i, I guess we, i can move both hang on I, I'll, 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 I'll go fix it we cleared space for the warehouse though so i'll just move the warehouse first i see a mushroom It to be true, I didn't want to announce anything. remember where I put the file. It's so sad. It spent a year in my notepad history on Windows. Robin is not here. Robin is closed to it for some reason. I don't know why. I have no idea why. When's yoga? I always forget they have yoga day. No, it's Tuesday. Yeah. I don't know. Robin is closed to it for oh. some reason. I'll just. I'm happy to keep looking for a pepper mushroom in the mines. So I'll stick down Go for then. it. I will. I guess I'll just keep decorating the place a little bit more. I'm sorry, I'm just decorating today. Fine. You gotta set a day for it anyway. Where I saw a ladder in that fog and then it disappeared. The latency is quite nice today. Not only the mines are reliability. is not finding anything. What are you? Oh, it was one of those guys standing behind a rock. I faced the wrong way. Idea of perfect. Okay, it's someone's favorites list. Not needed. Ah, 
I mean, we covered 20 floors. We have to technically find the mushroom floor somewhere. A fifth of the floors. What are the... Okay, so what's the actual hit rate? If we cover a fifth of the floors, what's the actual hit rate for finding the mushroom? I know I have found it in the first 20. Unless the game has patched it and it's different now. It's just the ladder here. Depends on luck for the day. The mushrooms are entirely static. Once you... Well, maybe you have to find them first? Mushroom floor is a static level, though. You can track it. That's why I'm trying to find this file. Because I don't know... Uh, the, the file might not help, but at least let me know the pattern. I remember tracking it for most of the first year in one of my saves. The luck definitely affects the amount of mushrooms though, but we just need one purple. Technically three. The fish want a purple mushroom too. Apparently those infested floors, you know how sometimes you'll get like a green slimy floor and it says you have to kill everything to find the ladder out? Apparently those are always in the same spot at, at specific days as well. found out about the infested floors today because the only one I ever used to track was the mushroom floor because it's such a good way to get mushrooms for free. If you know where it's going to be and you have a high luck day you just go down into the mines and get mushrooms because you get so many it's not funny. I never try it on a low luck day though I actually don't know if the luck affects the amount of mushrooms. I just always kind of made that assumption. Where is the bat? Yeah. I'm not even... Why bother? Nice. Is that... Is that it? No, we still need that one purple mushroom. And that will complete the, pre, uh, the thing. The community center. We should have gone the Georgia route. I mean, not should have, but then yeah. yeah that would have made things a lot easier if we did. But we're doing really good. It's like summer of year two. We've almost yeah. done with the thing. Yeah. enough copper in the mines to be self-sufficient on um, cherry bombs and I'm just using cherry bombs to mine the mines. Nice. Let's keep making more. Uh. Ow. 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 What happened? I got hit by a cherry bomb but it only dealt four damage. 
Yeah, the cherry bombs they don't do much. section of the mines. How much materials did you get? Oh, you can also buy bombs from the dwarf if you want. Considering also just making um oh lord I hate these things. But go slack on my game because they don't bounce properly. Oh. I was gonna say, considering making staircases down just jumping floors that don't have mushrooms on them. Oh lord. lethal just on number alone. <laughs> Cherry bombs. The ring is a magnet ring. Definitely. We still haven't put the trop. <laughs> the little green clip is still in our inventory just by virtue of us forgetting it's even there because we can't see it. It's 11 pm. See, I'm surprised the mines have built up this well. Are you, still, <clears throat> are you still in the mines? I'm heading home now. Is there anything you want me to grab on the way back? No, no, no. I was just like, I was just wondering. Did you find the mushroom? No. Okay, we'll find it tomorrow. Or we can get it from the ah! tomorrow, Friday. Do you, want the, do you want the trash machines to be there? I moved them inside the warehouse. But if you want, I can put them back there. The what, sorry? Uh, the trash machine. Oh, no, that'll be fine. Once we move the warehouse, it won't be so bad. Yeah, I think, yeah, I think, I think, I think we can do that tomorrow. Slime pick press. Did you did you make a thing? Did you make a a slime egg press? 
I can. I also have oil of garlic. Which I assume means you mean? garlic. No, I was talking about a slime hutch because a slime hutch is pretty useless. We don't need them for it. It's like, yeah. It's an annoying structure on the farm. Right, so a slime egg press doesn't do anything then? I mean, you can make it, obviously. Just like. It, everything doesn't have to make sense. I'm growing red cabbage right now just because they look good. stuff in here. Ah, that spot's... okay. <laughs> Let's get rid of that. Blue is got the gems. Mm, ores. Black has the mob. So, what has the crystals? Purple? This has a fish. Suppose I don't know whether. Oh! They were in the purple chest all the way back at Warlock's house. I half expected to jump out there and be at the new location. Uh, are you at Robin's? Uh, no, I'm back at the farm still. No worries, I can do that. It's fine. You can go and check uh, the traveling cart. Yeah, actually, good idea. Okay, before you go, can you move your shipping bin and your uh, the black box? Or have you already left? Oh no, you're there. <clears throat> no, no, not not this one, not this one. Yeah, I, I'm gonna move, I'm gonna move that again. I, I I'm just I'm just putting it there for the time being. Okay, is uh, there not enough room for the warehouse? Is the warehouse yeah, not I going in this bit here? Or did I move the wrong black box? Yeah, I mean I was talking about. Which one did you move? I was I was talking about the one in front of your house. This is where you. This, this is where. Okay. You... I thought this area over here was where the warehouse is going. I mean, okay, I can try that. If I do that, then I don't need to move the house. Um, it's gonna take me a little while to clear. Oh, I'll, I'll clear the other one, but it's gonna take a little while. That's all. That's fine. It's fine. Take your time. Everything in here. 
Your rabbit is escaping, I mean it's fine. They'll get back. Well, I have a bad news for you. I have I have, okay, it's I don't know if it's a good news or bad news. You will have to I mean if I if I if I want to fit this warehouse in You'll have to remove the, you'll have to remove that preserve jar, that green chest, and the orange chest. Do you want to do that? Otherwise, I can leave it where it was. Uh, jar. Let me give me a sec. I can get rid of everything. If you have to, re if you have to remove the preserve jar, I don't know what do you have in there. Salmon berry. Oh, you you, I, you didn't have to do that. Hundred gold. That's, that's fair. Okay. Uh, is that enough space? The orange uh, one as well? Boxes, but yeah, yeah. Bingo! Okay. Does the house fit in this spot over here then? Okay. Yeah, I like that one. This one? Yeah. Okay. I suppose when the garden, when the garden's here is grown, we'll probably shift the garden around a little bit as well. I like that. That's actually quite nice. All right. And things we place. Do we have things we place? Serves jar here, the bird can go there, the box can go back, the fire can go next to the bird, the two chests and a third chest. Where did the rubbish bin go? Did we not move a rubbish bin? Here and it's probably a chest in front of it. How's that? That makes me super close to the um to the warehouse though. I don't mind being that close. I think the perfume we... was on sale the other day. I think I must have just forgotten to get it. It'll be back. Hopefully. being picky with my colors now. I want them actually neighboring each other. Dark red, because dark red is where I'm keeping all my actual resources. Yellow for crops. Actually, what is red? Red's gonna be my new valuables. Orange is gonna remain seeds. Valuables. That stays the same. That's nice. But we need an extra chest. We need a black chest for all of this. We moved it over here, didn't we? We have more chest space over there too. So I can get super greedy for storage. There's my other bin. Oh, 
helps me space things out a little bit too. be weird. We're gonna change my mind again. Yellow. Orange. I like dark maroon for wood but we'll just turn it red for now. That still works. That's still fine. Now we need to figure out what's going where though. Those two will be fine. We'll put a third one there, perhaps. Candy cane! Donk. Where did the other candy canes go? Did I pack them up? I better have packed them up. Sending a stream soon. Right. One, two, three, four, five, six fish. Greenery. Where do we have the rest of the greenery? Oh lord. Where's that black chest? Let's get all this sorted, shall we? gonna worry about the all of the black chest is in. It's just the weapons and armor. 1050? Are you just napping or do you want to properly go to sleep? I mean if you if you I mean I, I don't want to go to sleep. If you if you're doing something finish it. No rush. Just pottering around getting everything sorted. Yeah yeah go ahead. But that's not time critical so Happy to sleep if you want to switch days. I mean, I have no such yeah, I have no such rush right now. It's like a waiting game while we wait for the mushrooms to pop up somewhere. But yeah, I will just make money, do that, save up enough money to buy some things, prepare ourselves for the skull caverns. Yeah, we haven't even touched the skull cavern. I actually, yeah, we, need, um, we, need, we need bombs, we need, uh, we need tons of things, we need staircases and stuff. So that's why I'm making jade right now for the staircases. I remember I went into the skull cabin and the first thing I saw was that I couldn't hurt anything. Uh, apparently one of the bugs doesn't get hurt. And I just bailed and I was like, you nope. Need a, I think you need a napalm, <clears throat> a napalm ring to get that. figure out one of those chests on the left from black to white have to be a high value chest or trinket chest oh uh the game is on a black screen for me i don't even see waiting for players yeah it's on black oh there we go hey now it shows the birdie has gone to bed i think i don't know it's weird very interesting you want sometimes. To restart the game? Just no? 
Um, it's, it's fine, it just happens occasionally. It just Are you having it makes me worried. No, I'm not, surprisingly. Today's been running amazing. Even when I'm down in the mines, it's not even lagging out like it did. I suppose this being the exception. Interesting. I hope it hasn't desynced, actually. Oh, thank god. Okay, so, I like the goods. It was gonna be yellow for goods, green for foraged, blue for the legendary fish. Should I just make yellow or green my goods? I think, I think we just have one. Where are you going to grow crops over here? Where I'm putting on the st the pathway? Otherwise, I'll I'll not put it. Um, if you want to do something over there. So I'm planning to grow crops just in front of the warehouse. I'm not gonna have a super big farm though. Okay, no worries. I mean, I'm just, I'm just like because I'm putting on the staircase, uh, the steps, right, on the path. That's why I was just wondering. Yeah, you'll be fine to put them down there. I think I'll just have a farm that's four sprinklers wide. I don't think I need too many things growing here. Uh, do you mind if I put the mayonnaise machine inside the coop? Go or, for it. I mean, if that's going, to be, if that's going to be a problem for you. No, then. no, go for it. Mayonnaise, put as much in there as you can. in yellow. Seeds and mushrooms. It's fine, mushrooms can go here. I don't even know why we're collecting these. And this goes here. back down in the caves. That's so annoying. I remember that. Three wide here, two wide here. That is so annoying. Oh my word. I did just drop and run here, didn't I? Wow, did I drop and run? I can't even pick it all up. basically gonna be my farm.
Gold, silver. I really... Maybe the fish go over here in the white chest and we make that purple or something. What a ton of eggs though. Do you have the mayo machines? Uh, they're inside the. They're inside the. Sorry, I'm. I, oh, in the barn. Yeah, in the. Yeah, in the coop. So you can just collect the eggs and directly put them inside. You can't open the auto collector unless there's something in it. Hmm. Oh, good. Perfect. The hay was staying in there, wasn't it? we never interact with the fish, right? They have to go on the other side somewhere. We're just gonna put them in... The white chest is valuables, right? So this will now be blue. I have to figure out a better color system and a pattern that doesn't annoy me. Was there. Why not? Why not just make it hodgepodge, right? Why not? Nothing wrong with hodgepodge. Hot pink. I actually don't even hate that palette. Now, valuables. Ooh, you can buy a dresser for all your clothes and rings at Robin's. Well, we have two red chests, but that's because this one's now maroon again. And that is dark orange. You know what? I, I like I like that. That's a nice that's a nice setup. So I now have gems and crystals go in the purple chest. These probably need to be sold. And these need to go somewhere else. Where did you um where's all the tree sap and the resin gone to now? Uh tree sap and the resin. They are 
in the warehouse in the in the, in the wood chest everything that you, everything that you need to um, craft things they're all in the warehouse Should we move the earth crystals over to the warehouse then? Oh, for the mayonnaise machine, right? I figure there's a couple of recipes yeah, yeah. that use them, isn't there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I think it's just the mayonnaise machine. But yeah, go for it. Is coral used to craft anything? Is what? The pink coral you pick up. Uh, no, I, I think it just sells for a good decent amount of money. Last of the. Ooh, do you put fish row in the barrels? The fermenting, the, the reserve jar. Just notice the preserve jars. I put two and two together. Preserve jars next to the fish pond. Is that because you can get stuff out of them? The rainbow trout row, I think we've got at the moment. At this point, this is now the save I've played the most. My main save from years ago is now. I don't old. like the fish pond. I mean, I like the fish pond, but I don't like the the path. This this this. The one that I'm walking on right now, it kind of looks weird. Could we switch this fish pond over to this side and then make the path straight down? Yeah, I think I think I think I'm gonna do that tomorrow. Yeah, that makes sense. I for some reason I thought that if the pond is next to the water, it'll look cool, but it does not look cool. We can also get rid of the bushes down here and place it just at the bottom. I was thinking like if we, yeah, because we'll not. Yeah, because you know that's that's a that's that's a good strat because we will not need the fish tank like that much yeah. that often. So we can actually put it down here. I think we can put it down here. Yeah, we can actually put quite a few of fish ponds next to each other. I mean, yeah, we can do that tomorrow. Ooh, the trees are in the way. That hurts. I mean, it's... Okay. Uh, this... Okay, since you're collecting it, this one is... Okay, hang on, let me get that. Uh, we have a box which is next to the shipping bin, which has... Oh, you're... Okay, hang on. That was my plan. If we take it straight down, we can make an E-line for the ponds down south. We can. I was thinking about using a different kind of pathing as well because I'm not yeah. sure how I feel about this. We can do this. We can do this. Hang on. Let me just see. There's, there should be a way I can give you things without giving like one at a time. If you pick up the pile and just throw it outside of your inventory, you drop the whole stack. It's actually probably a decent way to just the seeds thing we've been running into. Everyone else to stretch too. I think you're getting away. It's doing the black screen thing again. Okay. I 
have soup here as well that I made. Also, I will have to call it soon because I'm starting to feel that. Yeah, all oh good. Mayor Lewis wants truffle oil and says not to ask him why. I wish you could just ask him why. I mean, I'm just going to infer the worst case scenario and not explain, elaborate. Yeah, I don't even know, like, why... Hmm. Also, what do you think about this path? It does not add up and that's i hate trying to path this bit because it's the worst i feel like the only compromise i ever came to was just making it three wide and pretending this corner here doesn't exist We're hatching another chicken. Where? Oh, oh, okay. I <laughs> might move my stuff over there. The loom on you? The what? The loom. Mm, no, it's inside the coop. Oh, I just saw it. Thank you. You're welcome. about in Warlock's chat. Um, but if the moment's passed, I'm not gonna... We have... the... this blue thing. Could not be blue. It should be purple. And this should be dark green. There we go. Oh, why have I got a weird voice? Weird voices are illegal. Thank you very much. I've already concluded I sound like a Simpsons character. Do you think so... this looks nice? Or does it not look nice? It, weirdly, it's like the footpath has a footpath. It does not look nice, does it? No, I quite like it. Do we need to move the lower chest? Oh my lord, what, a... what happened to the gate? Uh, I'm just thinking if I like it. It's kind of weird. I don't know how I feel about this. Hang on, let me just take a screenshot. So many eggs backlogged. 
I'm sorry, what happened? We have so many eggs backlogged. I've just been running in and out of the dock of the coop, putting eggs in. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see what you mean. Yeah. That'll happen soon. Yeah, that, that happens very fast. Okay, that looks very decent. I like that. Don't worry, I'm just I'm keeping in mind the distance for your sprinklers. Yeah, that's actually the perfect distance. You're gonna have another one here in the middle. And once the um, oh, we've only got seven days left of summer. Uh huh. We have uh, not done much this season. I mean, we've done what's most left of the community sector. The only I thing mean, left I, is the I, mushroom. I'm complaining. I I did most of the the pottering around today. Just like I did nothing. <laughs> you gotta have days like that occasionally. I think this looks nice. I think I think this does not like you know the fact that it's off. It's not. I not, think. Yeah, the extra pile, the, the grey pile thing does offset it a little bit better. Yeah, I mean, the light and everything uh, over there, I think that's... I don't know. I'm happy with that, actually. Nice. Do you yeah. think... If we had, like, an extra layer of grey path here, because then it would enclose around the farm neatly, otherwise we're going to have... Yeah. You mean that, right? Yeah. Does that look bad? Uh, can you move the... Okay, I'll do it. No, it actually looks nice. Uh, okay, you can put it down once it's... One, yeah, now you can put it down. I think. But did you need more space? I mean, is that... Will that be enough for you to grow? Yeah, that's plenty. Okay. And you can, you can grow down like this as well. Yeah, that's basically what I'm thinking of doing. Having an L-shaped garden like that. Because there's just yeah, enough space yeah. here. This whole thing after I don't know, I, I like I think this tree has to go. Yeah, they should be grown. Yeah, yeah let's let's wait for them to grow up so that we can Because that's hardwood. hardwood. Yeah, that's hardwood. Speaking of, I need to go play, plant some maple seeds so that we can get oh, more of them. Supposed to move the, we were supposed to move the thing today. I completely forgot. Alright, I'll go check the out. Pond? Check out. Yeah, the pond. It's fine. It's not something which, like, it's not urgent or something. I will go check the, the cart lady. See what she's selling. It'd be nice to end stream today with a purple mushroom. I've never beat the community center before. It'll be a first. Kind of curious to know what happens. It's pretty nice. But I don't think we'll find one today. I'm pretty sure. I mean, you know what? I don't know. I don't want to say that. And then we find it. I hope we find it today. I just probably... want my cherry tree to grow up. I'll probably spend the rest of the day down in the mines. We got about ten hours. Oh, ten hours. We got five hours left before I have to come back. So. Wait, what do you mean five hours? Oh, okay. I was like, are we going in front of the five? <laughs> oh no, not IRL. Just in the mines. Okay. Oh, you mean in day five hours? I was like, okay, okay, that makes sense. I was like, wait. 
does she have to stream in another five hours and do something? Well, I suppose the priest is the ever important question. Are you still good for tomorrow morning? Oh, you I suppose, like... I suppose yeah, it'll yeah, be uh, this afternoon for you. It's, it's it's like uh, it's like another 14 hours. I have I have to, I have to go to sleep. I have to wake up. I have to work, and yeah, then well. I'll be playing with you. So yeah, I'll, yeah, the sun will go around the earth. I think half the times before. I, yeah. I'm sorry. Yes, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm saying a lot of things because okay. he's not processing things. That's the fire. I was there about two hours ago. I got my second wind. So, but yeah, just making sure. Because like, um, if you do, we did a fair amount today. I wasn't sure if you just wanted to switch I days around I, you know, and chill out. This is something... I'm sorry? No, no, I mean, I, I, I can... Yeah, I'm, I'm completely up for some games tomorrow. I would love to do it. Today I did not do anything because for some reason this is something which I've never done. Like, you know, like uh, purification of things. That's why I just wanted to try it out today and see how things work. Like trying to make your farm look pretty. Yeah. Not just functional. Although... Can I just say, your main save has some of the... I absolutely adore what you did with your main save. I haven't I've... done anything that. I, I'm working on it right now, growing some trees, but I, I'm glad that you like it. Don't get me wrong, I'm not being a snob. I suppose that's... Like, I... It's fair. Um, like, because to me, like, the pathing is more than I've ever done. I've never even put paths down. So seeing your main save, even without trees or anything, it's like, it just looks amazing to me. My standards are very low in this game. I mean, the thing is, like, I've seen some pretty amazing farms, and they, okay, see, like that. I, I think that sucks. If you can, if you can come out, check this out, and confirm if this is nice or something. What do you think about this? Or I'll have to what? check it out in the morning. I'm, I'm on floor thirteen at the moment. No, 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 it's fine. It's fine. I mean, I'm changing everything. Okay. Mushroom farm! Floor, I mean. Mushroom floor, where are you? I really, I want to greed for those. I know this floor is terrible, but I'm greeting for these chests. Nothing in them. Too hardwood! Look, I can't say nothing. It's too hardwood. Come on, you're telling me the explosion damage is laggy? That's fine. We learnt, we now know, flash is not the damage, it is actually the explosion. I didn't know those bugs hatched. I've learnt many things today. Right. I want to go back into Valheim and sail, but also that is going to hold me hostage. Going into Valheim and sailing is going to be like a whole two hour, three hour thing. It's going to be an adventure. That one just grew out of nowhere. Come on. The alternative, if we don't go back to Valheim and go sailing, the alternative is we play Deep Rock. I really feel like Deep Rock could be... It just depends. Do I feel like high intensity bug fighting or do I actually feel like killing in a boat? I could be up for either, honestly. Persuaded either way. Oh! Oh! I've come to the realization that my dawdling down in the mines may have killed me. What do you do? What have you done? I've got okay. lost and can't find the ladder. I have half hour to get home. Got... Do you have a portal leash? Why don't you take the teleporters with you? I don't know how. Where do they? Is there one to get home? Yeah, the farm, the farm teleporter. That's the one that takes oh. you home. Alright, um, I suppose I'll just pass out in your house on the floor.
Hi, house. Hello. I passed out in my inside my room. <laughs> I shouldn't find those things so amusing. I set mine next to my door, like it's a damn shopping door alarm. Like someone walks in, it goes beep. Uh, would you like to? Would you like to call it there and then make uh, it tomorrow? That would be a. I think that'd be a nice spot to end. We've got about six days yeah. left. Yeah, eight thousand from Mayo. I'm sorry. I got eight thousand from Mayo. These artisan goods are worth so much money. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. The artisan goods are amazing, and like, you get fifty percent more because of artisan park. Mm. It's really good. By the way, if you're heading to bed, what's Flicky doing up? He already slept for like I don't know, like three hours. So he's he's having a weird time. He cashed in early, he's didn't like, he? He's having a, he's having a jet lag without being on a jet. I think that's a good spot to end it there. I mean, we can. I mean, if do you want to finish this this season off? It's gonna be like another. It's like ten minutes per day. Six days will be an hour. We'll call it there. Yeah, we, yeah. Let's do that. Let's let's pick it up tomorrow. Because we will, yeah, you're right. We will be back to it in 12 hours. So. Yeah, yeah. In like 12 hours, we'll be back for it. 15 or so, yeah. I had a blast right, today, thank though. Thank you so much, for, yeah. so much for. I'm sorry? I had a blast today. It's been great fun. I had a really good time, yeah. I wouldn't have been able to stay up. But yeah, I had I had a really good time. Uh, Do you have anyone that you want to read? I don't have anyone in my mind. If you have any suggestion, we'll just head out. No idea. Do I don't know who's online. Do you to... Okay, go on. Let me check. All the people who are. Do you want to go to like what? Where do you want to go? Do you want to go to Stadio, or do you want to go to somewhere else? I. I leave it up to you. I have to be completely honest. I'm probably gonna keep streaming. Oh, you're gonna keep streaming? Is that what you said? We could go... Oh, I do have a favor. We could raid Itchy Tasty. I don't think I've ever um, raided Itchy Tasty before. Who's that? I'm the... He plays... Oh, maybe not tonight. He's playing Dead by Daylight. That's his... Um, he has... Oh, okay. He has games where he's great fun to watch and games where he... Uh, Dead by Daylight, basically. It's fun games and Dead by Daylight. They're two separate things. He plays a lot of Resident Evil stuff, though. Crazy QC's on. Mark Raiden's on. Jonathan's on again. Jonathan's on again. That is odd. Why is Jonathan on again? You're quite right. It's very late for him. I guess he got the rum out. So we should, we should, we should, we should, we should raid him and tell him not to stream. <laughs> raid and tell him to go to bed. I just go to bed, John. It's fine. But, uh, you know what? I'm, I'm just gonna. Follow you. Uh, I'm just looking at things. So like, Dark Raiden is on. Mm, Dark Raiden's always a good time. Is she doing another charity stream? Because she said she has charity streams for a while. Charity stream, yeah, for St. Jude's Children Research. Do you want to go to Dark Raiden? Let's go to Dark Raiden. I think that'd be a good spot. Yeah, because she's doing some charity. So.
Hello there. Hello there. Welcome in. I'm gonna have a crack. I know. It's been explained to me how many times now? Shahusha? Shahusha? Uh, no, I did it right better the first time. Hey, Bob. You didn't go over that. <laughs> I'm terrible. Shahusha? Oh, am I not getting this? Welcome in. Welcome to the mess that is my stream. Are you still here? The mess. You have chosen or been chosen to view some of the most scuffed. Co I missed my scuffed button. Case in point. Hi. <laughs> Hi, sorry. Yes, I'm still here. I suppose you'll be heading off to bed soon. Uh, yeah, that's the plan. I think I'll just go to sleep. Sounds like a plan. I'm sorry. Can you can you hear me? Yeah. Or are you am I am I? Sorry. Yeah, yeah. I, I I can hear you. I was I was like, are you talking to me? Are you talking to me? because? Yeah. I and also, were you talking to me just before this as well? I thought you were talking to your stream. I did mute for a little bit. Um. I mean, like, honestly, I, I don't remember. When you mute, I can't. When you when you mute, I don't think your mute is working. Let me try. If I mute now, I'm gonna keep talking. This sentence will not stop, but I will keep speaking. Am I, I mean, able to be heard? Now. I mean, it works now. I can. There, mm. there must be like a bit of delay on it. I think. <laughs> yeah, but okay. So I think you're saying something like, you know, what do you say? Like the mess that is my stream. And I was like, wait, hang on. Is she getting raided? Oh, no. What? Bob came in and said hello. <laughs> Oh. And then I hit like all the wrong buttons. Huh. But yes, that's what I was like. I was gonna say. I think I'm just gonna like yeah. I'm just I'm not. I'm just gonna say hi to Red and say like. And say, I think I'm just gonna go. It's to yeah. Right now. Considering you have to have a day tomorrow as well at stream, I think mm -hmm, it would be good. Mm -hmm. I I need to have like a whole day. Alrighty, I've left. Okay. I'll talk to you in the morning. Right. Gets, yeah, care. so that'll be get some, summer, get some fall, rest. and winter. Can we see if we can get it through all the fall? Hopefully, yeah. No. See you in the morning. Oh, I suppose. Night -night. Yeah. He'll be sleeping, but it'll be afternoon. But... Oh, Flicky, welcome in. Let's close that down. We'll end. Let's put Christ. Ooh, we'll throw a casual 90,000 down. There we go. Why do I not sleep? I've only been up for like 15 hours, Flicky. I did sleep. It was just 15 hours ago. We spent the whole day streaming. <laughs> Alrighty. We've got a crew together. We could put down a hundred thousand an extra zero than what I put down on my heist. Let's find out. Let's find out what the results of the heist is. Anyone? Let me just... Because we didn't wait up. Shout out to Dark Raiden. I have typed exclamation heist and however many points I want to put down on the gamble table. We've got a ton of people. There's so many points in on this heist, actually. Sin Valentine's looks like he's going all in because he's got a really specific number. No, he hasn't gone all in. He's rounded his number down to 25 million and bet the excess. Fascinating. 
But worth popping over and saying hello to, to Dark Raiden and leaving a lurk if you're able to. She's doing a charity stream for St. Jude's Children's Research Hospital, so any promotion I think in, in that regards is going to be welcome. Absolutely go give her a shout out. You don't have to donate, but I think all donations for the duration of the charity event will go into St. Jude's Children's Research Hospital. You're heading off, Joe? I'm Em. <laughs> Woo! I got a payout. It has begun. Everyone gets ready and loads their weapons, checks their equipment before hopping out of the van and heading straight into the bank. A few naughty ones got caught along the way, but most of the team made it out of the bank safely with some loot. Results from the heist? Board Brain, 157,500. Dark Raiden, 1,750,000. Uncase the Mace, 17,500. And Sin Valentine, with 604,000. 460. Who got caught? Void Biscuit got caught. Who else went in? Who else went in? You've initiated the raid. I did, idiot. <laughs> it was my raid, it was my heist in, in Dark Raiden's chat. So, believe it but still that's a fun little mini game you can do over at dark raiden's channel clicky you've already slept do you think you'd be up for some deep rock galactic hmm i could honestly i could switch to anything but for the time being i am going to take a quick break oh i need a bathroom break and a stretch I should be back in a few minutes and we can pick a game to switch to. I'm honestly, I'm in a bit more of an energetic mood. I could switch to Deep Rock Galactic. I could honestly switch back to Dirt Rally. I've got a couple of minutes spare and I'm pretty sure I can use up to like an hour and a half of my crisp audio filtering, but we'll get to that in a second. Don't go anywhere, I'll be right back. I, uh, I forget. <laughs> The, the, the uh, whole music layering thing, the only downside is that I have a transition out system at the moment. It's about 25 to 30 seconds of this song right now that plays when I turn music off. And then it goes silent. It doesn't loop, it doesn't repeat. So I can have any playlist playing, and then if I turn that playlist off, this plays instead. But it's a once only thing. And it's a great way. Um, basically, the system was I. The idea of the whole system is that I have sailing music, which is very dark and dreary. And then when I get off the boat, I'm meant to turn sailing music off, and then that plays. It's a neat little system, but it has its flaws. And the first one, of course, obviously being if I hit AFK, AFK music. Uh, so. When you have a layered audio system like this, it's modular and I love it, but it, it has workarounds. I just need to remember to, to turn my music off in advance before going AFK like that. But enough rambling. I need to go stretch my legs and I'll be back in a second. Don't go anywhere.
And I'm back. How much delay are we dealing with on my phone? <laughs> Not very much. My phone's got maybe 20 seconds delay max. Which is still pretty good for talking back and forth with people. Those of you who stuck around, thank you. I don't actually know. I have a fair bit of energy. So there's two ways I think we can end stream today. The first is we go up with a bang. We do something like Dirt Rally, Deep Rock Galactic. We do something full of energy. And then I absolutely pass out the moment I end stream. Or we can chill, load up Valheim. We could load up No Man's Sky. I don't know. I, I want to stop No Man's Sky. We finished the expedition. I'm going to play it in my own time. But just because the performance runs so poorly as well, I think No Man's Sky is going to be coming to an end. I'm going to need a hardware upgrade before I play that game on stream again, I think. But that leaves. Deep Rock Galactic. Let's have a look. Let's go through our games. Deep Rock Galactic. It's going to take four, five, or six hours to beat Crash Bandicoot 2. My thing with that game, I want to beat Crash Bandicoot 2 in one sitting. I want to beat all of those games in one sitting. Pardon me. Three Crash Bandicoot streams and then I can uninstall the game. How much space does it take up? 30. Oh, 30 gigabytes and it's on my REFS drive. It's the refs. Ouch. So we have Dirt Rally. The Dirt Rally. Um, not Dirt Rally 2. We have... We have Monster Hunter World. I might have to drop a couple of the quality settings on that game. I don't remember how it streamed last time. Do we have any suggestions? And Flicky, if, if you want to join us with Deep Rock, that settles it. We'll play Deep Rock. Went to put on the dishwasher, what did I miss? I suppose you'll hear the question in a few seconds. Oh, another chill game if we just want to veg it out. I have Hunter Call of the Wild. I'm definitely going to be streaming Hunter Call of the Wild when Finland comes out. So we might save that for later, shall we? Feeling much for playing Deep Rock? I overdosed a bit in on oh, no, the past two days. That's all good. We have other things we can do. Goes out of Discord for now. Jump in the dance floor and meet Discord in OBS so that if anyone joins, I'll hear them, but you guys won't. So if, okay, Flicky, here's a, here's a thing we can do. If I give you three genres of video game, and you pick one, that'll decide what we do. The first genre of video game is driving. Racing driving. The second genre of video game, survival crafting. That one is probably an obvious guess what it's going to be. And the third genre, shooter. Play Oblivion. Unfortunately, adventure was not adventure fantasy was not any of those genres, sadly. And Oblivion's last in the Elder Scrolls series anyway for me. I'm playing Arena first. No, I should probably check that I can actually play Arena at all someday. I need to check if Arena even opens and runs properly. I'm gonna have to desperately look up ways to make sure that opens in a window because if that opens full screen I, I detest I detest any game that opens dedicated full screen 
I have two monitors. Don't turn both of them off for any program in the world. The inversion runs okay. I'm hoping they've repackaged it. A vampire masquerade. Sadly, I don't own it, but it does look like a lot of fun. The only downside is it's PvP. It still looks neat, I will admit. Redemption? Red Dead Redemption? Good lord, that's even worse than No Man's Sky. Wait, Vampire Masquerade Redemption? I thought Vampire the Masquerade was just the name of the new one. I can't write Redemption because I have Red Dead Redemption. What? What? Vampire the Masquerade Shadows of New York. If the first category that comes up is a visual novel. Um, draw distance franchise? Can I just search Vampire? Vampire the Masquerade Blood Hunt. Bloodlines 2. Bloodlines 1. The Sims 4 Vampires. Are you shitting me? EA cut up Supernatural into separate pieces? Oh, if you couldn't get any more scummy with a franchise than that, holy shit. You used to buy Supernatural, it came with witches, the like it came with witches, zombies, everything, including vampires. Now you just get the vampire pack. Ten dollars, please, bet. Bet it's ten dollars. I was wrong, I was wrong, it's actually twenty. It's $20 for vampires. Fuck off, EA. I honestly, I love the creation and house building in Sims 4, but I detest EA at this point. I will not buy games from them. Blood Hunt, I think, is the new one, isn't it? 27th of April 2022. That's the. Um, Blood Hunt is the. Blah, 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 blah. The Battle Royale. Thank you, Brain. Redemption. Vampire Redemption. Masquerade Redemption. Inhabiting the world of darkness, you must face a series of brutal confrontations with your nemesis Vuko. <clears throat> with your nemesis Vukodlak. Powerful vampire lord. <laughs> you look like a it's like the stereotypical sword wielding hero, but it's kind of funny looking. Maybe that was an enemy, I don't actually know. Got Diablo layout for the HUD, for the gear. Oh, I'm sold. Wish list. Complete your bundle for only $700. Buy the Activision collection. 10% off. Oh, great. So it's down from like $800 to $700. Thank you. How nice of you. Time shift is in the bundle though. And, hey, I will say, keep an eye out on those bundles, right? As dorky as they can sometimes be like this one, $700 for Activision games. I mean, it's got a lot of old Activision games and there's my point, right? Some old games get delisted off of Steam, but they don't remove them from these bundles. So if you can find a bundle that has a game that's been delisted on Steam, you can still buy the bundle, you'll get the license even though the game's been delisted for single purchase. I don't know how common that situation is, but I know I've got a couple of games myself by buying bundles where I could not otherwise get copies of those games. EA are a bad company, never support. I, EA are the one time I'll buy from a key selling website that isn't humble. Humble is the good boy key reseller. Other ones are not good boy key resellers and people get angry at you when you use them. But Humble's allowed. <laughs> okay, tell me the difference. Like me old and cheesy. You're only as old as you feel on the inside. For some people, I suppose that's not a good thing. <laughs> I 
It's about a holy knight who gets cursed with vampirism and has to deal with inner struggles and what he has become and his redemption. There you go. My insides feel about 125. <laughs> yeah, I guess maybe that's not the best line to say some people. The next one I normally say is, you're not 125 years old, you're 125 years young, Flicky. There, there, look. I fixed it. Okay, do we play a boring game? You never picked one of my three categories. Copy pasting that from Google. The, <laughs> the stupid quotes about age. I basically could, couldn't I? A generic enough. What do we do? Okay, three categories. That's what you told me word for word earlier. Yeah. I mean... Yeah. It's a common saying. Don't... Don't call me out for that. 